Tis the night before Halloween when a little girl screamed. Let there be light. Boom! And light there is. It is not quite Halloween yet, but we are hours away. <laughs> what day is it? It's Creepy Freaky Friday. Happy early Halloween to everybody in the building. We are going uh, wireless right now. So uh, before we experience any technical difficulties, we are going to switch over to hardwire here. So bear with me, guys. I hope you guys are doing well. Give me a thumbs up if all is well in chat. <laughs> And it is a creepy, creepy <laughs> Friday. Hi, everybody. And Gigi's in the building. All right, guys. We are just going to toggle to hardwire, so we may experience a slight interruption here. Just bear with me. All right. Sugar Rush. <laughs> What's going on? Adam Stacks is in the building. TJ is in the house. Sparkle Flair is here. Rafe Ailman, Breeze is in the building. Dove season is here. Fresh cup of coffee and all. It is going to be a long night, guys, because it is the night before Halloween. We will be playing some uh, Guess That Candy games. We will be uh, giving away some uh, goodie bags for Halloween uh, in the end of stream. And there are three to be exact. Let's take a look here. We got three Halloween goodie bags full of some nice sweets. But we also have a coin in each goodie bag. So if your name is selected at the end of stream, you will have the option to choose between the three goodie bags. And what you select, we will unveil at the end of the stream, guys. What's going on? Reese is in the building. Brad Burge is here. DRS is here. Ozzy is in the building. I hope you guys are enjoying your Friday. We have made it through another work week, and we have 35 items on tonight's auction, guys. And I am very happy about this list tonight. If you have not looked at the auction list, you can find the link in the description of this video. Uh, if the link is not working, all you have to do is scroll further down and you will find the entire list right there in the description. And there's also the free stream giveaway link, which I will enter in chat. So if you, if you have yet to comment on that link, please do so. We will be selecting some entries via the random comment picker. We will also be playing some games. And I am excited about this. I hope you guys are ready. We're going to wait till a, a few more people filter in. I know it's a busy Friday night, and I have my Halloween costume here. <laughs> yes? Yeah. I think I look pretty cute. I don't know. <laughs> so uh, it won't take long to find out what I'm actually wearing on my head. But for the people that are in here right now, if you can guess Ooh. the object that is on top of my head right now, you will gain three entries into the jackpot. Let's see. <laughs> you might not be able to guess this, guys. So what I'll do is I'll throw in a, uh, a one gram Valcambi silver bar as well. Let's see. Gigi, you keep a lookout. What's going on, Henry? Henry's in the building. Noel is here. Great Lake Stacker is here. It is a freaky, creepy Friday night. A and creepy, freaky Friday. Dennis Stewart's in the building. Shout out to Dennis who donated two uh, one-ounce copper rounds to the end of stream giveaway. There is also a one-ounce mystery silver coin that is in the goodie bag as well. So three goodie bags, one coin in each. <laughs> no, I'll guess Gigi's head. <laughs> Well, you got the first part right, but uh, I am wearing something of Gigi's because she was generously uh, 
<laughs> and she was very generous in allowing me to wear it. What's going on, Rockzilla? Rockzilla is here. EMP's in the building. Big shout out goes to EMP who uh, designed the uh, thumbnail for tonight. So thank you so much, EMP. That was a pleasant surprise, and uh, I really love it too. So thank you so much for that, for taking the time to do that. <laughs> I was not expecting that, brother. Dreadpool is here. What's going on, Dreadpool? Someone gets Gigi's diary. <laughs> Herbert Cox is here. Gigi Pillow. Oh, they're still going. I, I don't know. It may be difficult to guess it, but you guys will find out probably on item number two since we're doing a proof set. So there'll be a little face reveal. <laughs> and if you can't tell by then, then I don't know what to tell you guys. What's going on? The Wayne is here. Rockzilla says shower cap. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you guys had a good week so far. We have 35 items on the list. And once again, if you have not commented on the comment video, take a second to do so. We will be uh, pulling up the random comment picker, and we're going to select three names to enter into the jackpot. Now, Gigi, if you see someone guess correctly, okay. if they're able to guess what I'm wearing on my head correctly, they will get a one gram Valcambi Swiss uh, silver bar, and they will also receive three entries into the jackpot. That's a very good guess, a parking cone. A parking cone. <laughs> <laughs> Knowing you. Oh, my goodness. That would do so much uh, to my neck during the three-hour, four-hour stream that I probably wouldn't even dare try. Sharp Eye Four Coins is in the building. Good to see you, Sharp Eye. Rockin' Roots is here. Good to see you, Rockin' Roots. U.S. Silver Stacker is in the building, everybody. We are fired up and wired up, and we're going to get started shortly here. But let's pull up the random comment picker, and we're going to select three names really quickly here. So let's take a look. First is Dizzy. So congrats, Dizzy. You have been entered into the jackpot. Let's refresh. <laughs> And pick two more names. Noel said GG shirt. GG shirt. Not quite, Noel. Not <laughs> quite. Next is Chris Brummett. Chris Brummett. Congratulations. You have been entered into the Halloween jackpot giveaway for the end of stream. And we'll do one more. And we'll, we will be using the random comment picker uh, after the entrees, the appetizers, and at, before the uh, before we pull the winner, uh, so Kason, Kason, two thousand and six, you will get one entry as well. So congratulations to those whose names were selected here in the beginning. Here are the entries. Dizzy, you will get entry number ninety eight. Chris Brummett, you will get entry number seventy three. And Kaysen, 2006, <laughs> you will get number 50. So check this out. 98 for Dizzy. 73 for Chris. And 50 for Kaysen. Good luck. And they are in there. We will also be adding entries 1 through 35. Each entry uh, represents the auction number. So if you win auction lot number one, you will receive entry number one. So we're going to enter 1 through 10, uh, 11 through 20, 21 through 30, and 31 through 35 into the jackpot, which you can see here to the right. All right. Now, here we go. So we'll be playing some, uh, some can guess that candy games as well. And we're just going to have fun. So I hope you guys enjoy yourself. This is a Halloween theme uh, auction, and we have four Halloween themed coins. Three of them will be on the list. One of them will be in the jackpot. Next year we should do that, Daddy. We'll get my solid green belt, and we'll tie it around your head and make it like a pirate. <laughs> That's right not there. a bad idea. I'll do that. Yeah. <laughs> What's going on? Sheena Smith is here. Herb Ash is in the building. Thank you guys for being here, and we're going to get started. Put a one in chat if you're ready to go, and of course, if you're new, we do need you to verify your account 
How do you do that? All you have to do is send a $1 refundable verification payment to SakaBlapaNY at gmail.com. That will make sure that uh, you have an active PayPal account and that we have your shipping information and that you are also of age to participate. What's going on? Spoon is here. Should Good to see you, Spoon. Uh, yeah, people are, are. So right now, people are trying to guess what I'm wearing on my oh, head. There's a hint. There's a little something Ooh, that's called very Gigi's close. zombie. Oh, it's a zombie. what's it's going zombie. on, Sean? 47. They're getting warmer. And the winner will receive uh, three jackpot entries and a one gram Valcambi Swiss silver bar. What's going on? Silver Streak is here. Rafe Ailman's in the house. Daniel D'Ambrosio. It is a freaky, creepy Friday night. And we are going to get started here, guys. A lot of nice items, very unique items, and some low mintage coins as well. So let's get started here. And Gigi will keep an eye out if, if uh, we get an answer. Should I say the letter it starts with? Uh, no, let's keep it flowing here. Uh, what's going on? Alice in Silverland. Love the name, Alice. Thank you so much for joining us. Addicted to Stacks is in the building. All right, guys. So you will find out uh, when we reach up, uh, reach item number two here, what I'm actually wearing. I have just received a uh, verification uh, registration payment. So if you if you sent it, please let me know. That way I, I can uh, sync your personal information with your YouTube name. Silver Street said Burger King. Burger hat. King. <laughs> <laughs> My dentures. Well, I don't have many teeth remaining, Adam, but. Good thing I'm not wearing dentures quite yet. You know, a funny story really quickly before we get started. Thank you, Patriot Stacker, for verifying. Uh, so a funny story. Ethan, one time when we were when we spend the night in my, uh, my mother's house, this was a while back, uh, we all crashed, and it must have been a holiday or something. The next morning, my grandmother woke up yelling because Ethan ended up flushing her dentures down the toilet. We needed to call plumbing to come up and fix everything. <laughs> so we can laugh at it now, but it was a very horrendous situation that we had to fix there. Shout out to Ethan and shout out to Tata. If Tata's uh, listening with uh, Mama Plata. All right, guys, let's get started here. Uh, so what should we do? Should we... Because I, I don't want people to start guessing while we are uh, doing the first item. So what we'll do, guys, we'll end it here. Well, and the we'll end it here. And what we'll do is when the face reveal or the partial face reveal comes uh, on lot number two, you guys can begin guessing after that auction item is complete. Or maybe before we start bidding. We'll, we'll figure it out. Either way. We're going to have some fun tonight, guys. Thank you guys for joining me. Maximus is here. Hidden is here. And we're going to get started. Lot number one is a Greece telephone token from 1950 to 1960. Now, there's not a year on here, but this is the time frame where these were made. This is brass, and it will start at $1. We already have it at 3 All right. We have hidden that. Three, just edging, uh, edging out sharp eye for coins. Adam Stacks taking it to three and a half and hidden, bringing it to four now. Sean 47, are you wearing a hat made from the face of your last victim? You know, we went to Party City and, and there were some very cool masks, but I didn't pick anything up for me personally, so Gigi's letting me borrow something of hers. Uh, so we have hidden at four. Hidden at four, going once, going twice now. Herbert says your hair. Unfortunately, I've been bald for several years, Herbert. So I wish it was my hair. Unfortunately, it is not. We have hidden at four for the Grease telephone token. Oh. Lynn and TJ coming in with a sniper alert at four and a half. Four and a half. Looking for five, five. Do we have five? 
And, you know, it's funny. I'm not sure you'll even be able to tell in the reflection of the proof coin when that arrives, but you may be able to tell. You should be able to tell. We'll see. Depends how good it's picked up on camera. We have TJ at four and a half for the telephone token. Going once. Going twice now. TJ at four and a half, looking for five. All in. All out. Last call. And sold to TJ for four and a half. Congratulations, TJ. You are on the board, my friend. You will receive jackpot entry number one. And that is the first item of the night. Four and a half for TJ. Congratulations. Very cool Greek telephone token. So, TJ, we are going to add that to your wallet. So let's add that to TJ's wallet here. It is in there. All right, guys, next up is item number two here. But before we start bidding, let's see if you guys can take a look. And the reason why I put this on at the beginning is because I don't plan to wear this thing the whole time. But we're going to take a look here. This will be the next item. Can you guys tell what is on my head? I don't think you guys can see it. We have a winner! Winner, winner, chicken dinner. We have a winner. Stop, guys. The winner is, let's take a picture here. Let's take a picture here before we get into item number two because we have a correct answer. And that answer is a veil. And TJ, you are first on the list here. Veil, you just Edged out DRS and Patriot Stacker. Brad Burge also guessed correctly. TJ even corrected himself. Wedding veil. But yes, it is a veil. It is a veil. And it's a zombie veil to be exact. So there you see it. So some great guesses. If I would have known, I mean, this was pretty difficult. Probably should have made the prize a little bigger. So what we're going to do, we'll turn it into uh, two grams of uh, Valcambi uh, silver bar. So congratulations to TJ. You will also gain three entries into the jackpot. And your three entries are 99, 54, and 81. You will also receive a pair of one gram Valcambi Swiss silver bars. All right, TJ, congratulations. And good luck. You have four jackpot entries already. And let's get into item number two. This is a 1968 SUS proof set. And the starting bid is $1. Now we have 15 items tonight starting at $1. And a lot of them are very interesting as well. We have Patriot Stacker at 10 now. Patriot at 10. Look at 11, 11. Do we have 11? What's going on? Rebel Randy is here. Good to see you, Rebel. Main D is in the house. Am I missing anyone? Randy is in the building. Good to see you, Randy. We have Patriot Stacker at 10. Going. Wants. Going twice now. Noel says build reveal. <laughs> yeah, I think I need to uh, increase the push-ups here. Patriot stacker at 10. All in. All out. Last call. And... Sold 
to Patriot Stacker for $10. Congratulations, Patriot Stacker. That is item number two. And you get it for 10 bucks. Can't go wrong with that. And you will also receive jackpot entry number two. Once again, to end the stream, we will be giving away three goodie bags filled with sweets and coins. So uh, there's a coin in each goodie bag. Uh, two one-ounce uh, copper rounds, courtesy of Dennis Stewart. And a one-ounce mystery silver coin will be in a bag as well. So we'll have three, and the first person that is selected at the end of the stream will uh, have an option to select which bag they would like. So if they pick the right one, they'll get the one ounce silver. All right. And what did I? <laughs> I, I saw Dennis. Uh, hey, Saka Blot, the face looks a bit dirty. Hey, Gigi, go get a face cloth to clean them up. <laughs> And Mrs. Flopper always spoils me with that. So probably tomorrow, Mrs. Flopper will be saying, you know what? I think it's time to shave. <laughs> All right. So let's see here. Congratulations to Patriot Stacker. Uh, the $1 verification payment will be deducted from your total. And uh, once again, guys, uh, here is the comment video. Make sure you get in there, and we will uh, be selecting some names via the random comment picker. We will also be playing some games. So here we go. Let's get into item number three. Now, this is a clad coin, but this is a lower mintage clad coin. Uh, and if you look it up on Numista and on NGC, you can see that it actually goes for uh, more than we probably would think right off the bat. So I, pull, I plucked this out of a world coin bag. This is a 1938 Portugal 50 centavos clad coin. And the mintage is 923,000 on planet Earth. And it's in pretty good shape. We have hidden at five now. Hidden at five. Five looking for six. Uh, Noel says, please read my last comment. It says, while we are on the topic of 40% halves, I got 51 face silver halves from the bank. Boom! Noel with the steal. That is awesome. That's what we call legal bank robbing, my friend. Congratulations on the score. We have hidden at five, looking for six. And if you guys haven't yet put this into your search bar, if you enter 1938 Portugal 50 centavos, you will take a look and you will see what these are going for. It's not a crazy amount, but we did start it at $1 either way. So we have Rafe at six, looking for seven. Rafe at six, looking for seven. What's going on? Armando's in the building, everybody. Good to see you, brother. Thank you for joining us tonight. It is Freaky Creepy Friday, and I'm wearing a bridal veil on my head. Rafe at six. Going once. D Dub is in the building. Good to see you, D Dub. Going twice now. We have Rafe at six, looking for seven. All in. All out. Last call. And so to Rafe Ailman for six dollars. Congratulations, Rafe. Very nice coin there. I believe it's showing around thirteen dollars in in XF, or is that fine? I'm not sure. Uh, but if you look, you actually got a very good deal there. So congratulations to Rafe. You will get entry number three into the jackpot. All entries from one to 35 have been pre-entered at the beginning of the stream. And uh, here we go. So that's $6 for Rafe Ailman. And we're going to add that to your wallet. And Rafe's wallet is growing very nicely. All right. Next up is a heavily circulated... 1899 Barber Quarter here. 
That's an 1899 Barber Quarter from Philly. It is in rough shape, but it's pre-1900. So if you need it to fill your album, this will be a hole filler for now at least. We have Sean at one. Hidden, taking it to five now. Five, looking for six. What's going on? Gibby's in the building. Good to see you, Gibby. Adam says, you're going to bring us some foreign gold on the next auction, Saka? Uh, uh, Adam, I am definitely always on the lookout for some foreign gold. The only issue is it's kind of a sweet spot of mine. So the foreign gold that I've been able to locate lately has been super low mintage, and it's been a struggle to part ways with. So I do apologize for that, guys, but we will have some foreign gold as well on future auctions. We have Dennis at seven, looking for eight now for the 1899 Barber Quarter. Dennis at seven, going once. Jay Corona's in the building. Good to see you, Jay. Going twice now. We have Dennis at seven, looking for eight for the 1899 Barber Quarter. All in, all out, last call, and we have a sniper alert, TJ, coming in at seven and a half, dump for cover, GG. The first sniper of the night, as I was just going to enter sold in the comment box. And Dennis coming right back at eight now. We have Dennis at eight looking for nine, nine. Do we have nine? And once again, guys, we have some nice Halloween themed coins on the auction menu as well. Going once. We have Dennis at eight. Going twice now well thank you so much alice i enjoy being here on tuesday and friday night spending my time with you guys and uh definitely was looking forward to this auction we have dennis at eight all in all out and tj with another snipe look out dennis tj is sniping tonight Eight and a half, and Dennis bringing it to nine. Back and forth they go, back and forth they go. 1899, Barber Quarter. And we're going to count this down. We have Dennis at nine. TJ says, give it to him. I need to cook some food. We just finished devouring some chicken with some madudos and tostones. And a mix of a whole bunch of stuff. We, we're having a good time over here. A little bit of candy in between. It's it's just pandemonium, I tell you. The night before Halloween. It is the night before. Be That's right, Gigi. Dennis at nine. All in. All out. Last call. And. Soul to Dennis Stewart for $9. Congratulations, Dennis. You will receive jackpot entry number four. And Dennis wants to send that to the front of me, Silver Sacks. So we're going to put that in Silver Sacks' wallet, courtesy of Dennis. Very cool of you, Dennis. And is the front of me hanging in the background? Who's sniping over here? If you haven't yet said hello, say hello to the people, everybody. 1899 Barber Quarter goes to Dennis for nine dollars. And uh all right, that is a gift for Saks, and it is in his wallet. All right, guys, we're going to play the first game of the night here. Uh, we're not going to enter this in chat. So, guys, please pay attention to the screen in front of you. We're going to use 
Should we use my hand or your hand, Gigi? My hand. Your hand? Okay. My hand is pretty. Okay, so guys, listen closely. What I am going to ask you is to guess what brand. Brand? What brand? Let's take a look here. I want to make sure. I know the brand. Okay, you see that there? Mm -hmm. All right. So what brand of candy is in Gigi's hand? Let's try to get around here, Gigi, so that they can see. And once we see the correct answer, we will drop it. What brand of candy? Let's take a look here. Maybe open one side to uh, give them a little clue, Gigi. Let's see here. Yeah, you can you probably let, let it hang out a little bit so that, oh, what is that? What is that? Nothing yet. I see it. We have a winner. We have a winner. Stop in the name of love before you break my heart. I know. We have a winner, winner, chicken dinner. All right, Gigi, go for it. The winner is Brad Bird. Brad Bird, the congratulations. Was Gobstoppers. Gobstoppers is correct. So, Brad, you will gain one entry into the jackpot, my friend. Congratulations. Let's see here, Brad. You will receive entry number 51. And you will also receive a one gram Valcambi Swiss silver bar. So let's uh, put the uh, one gram Valcambi as well. So once again, that's number 51. So all the games we play will be accompanied by a one gram Valcambi Swiss silver bar. However, the random comment pickers we will, uh, let's see here. You know what? Every every winner tonight, every game winner, and every random comment picker will get a Valcambi Swiss one gram bar tonight. So that means Dizzy will get one. That means Chris Brummett will get one. Uh, Kaysen will get one. But Kaysen, you have to claim your prize. So Kaysen, if you're here, please uh, make sure you email me your information. Uh, Dizzy, Chris, and Brad all have wallet accounts. All right. What's going on, Maria? Maria, Maria. AG Heap is in the building. Good to see you. Sterling Cannabis is in the house, everyone. Thank you guys for joining me on this creepy, freaky Friday night. We are going to move on to item number five. Item number five is a, uh, let's see here. Is it hidden? Oh, <laughs> hidden. You had me look. Had, you had me look here on the list to see if you uh, won anything. I'm sure you'll win one, Hidden. You always do. We have a pair of one gram Valcambi Swiss silver bars. It is a combi bar. You can break it into uh, separate one gram pieces here. And we have Sparkle Flare at eight. The, what, if you were to cut that, would you like need a knife, or can you just like? You can snap it? it off. You kind of have to wiggle it just a little bit. We have Dreadpool at nine and Sparkle Flare firing back at ten. Sparkle Flare at ten. Look at eleven, eleven. Do we have eleven? EMP says she reminds me of the West Side Story. By the way, they did not need to remake that song. Sorry, Rihanna, but come on. Sometimes the original is the best. Do you guys agree? We have Dreadpool at 11. Dreadpool at 11, looking for 12. Dennis says, no, Sokka, no, my ears are leaking. Well, it is Creepy Freaky Friday, Dennis. So you don't even need to go to the store and buy the, uh, the fake blood. All you have to do is listen to my singing, and there you have it. We have Dreadpool at 11. Going once. 
going twice now. Dreadpool at 11. All in. All out. Last call. And sold to Dreadpool for $11. Congratulations, Dreadpool. You get it for 11, but we are going to roll the price back here. So, Dreadpool, let's roll the price back. Let's roll the price back here. Uh, so, it sold for 11, and we'll roll it back to $9. And let's turn it into a buy it now at the $9 price point. This is a pair, so you will be buying a pair of one gram Valcambi Swiss. That's a pair. So we have Sparkle Flare. We're going to buy it now. One. What's going on? Great Scott is here. Good to see you, Scott Jarvey. We have Scott Jarvey. We're going to buy it now. One. We have TJ with a buy it now one. And if anyone else is interested, you will also receive an entry into the jackpot. And Maximus with a buy it now one as well. All right, let's get some entries here. Sparkle Flare, you will receive entry number 65. Scott Jarvie, you'll receive entry number 82. TJ, you will receive entry number... 96 and maximus you'll receive entry number 84 so shipping is uh four dollars for five ounces or less eight dollars flat rate with insurance for five ounces or more or six ounces or more excuse me all right uh so yes dreadpool if you wanted to add uh additional to you you let me know all right i have Thirty remaining, and uh, we will go over all of the buy it nows at the end of the stream as well. So if anyone is looking for me to recap, I can do that as well. All right, guys. So let's pull up the random comment picker here, and we're going to select three more names. Three more names here, and you can win multiple times. So here we go, 49 unique comments. Good luck. Every winner tonight uh, in terms of the random comment picker and the uh, – look at that, Chris Brummett once again. Congratulations, Chris. So not only will you receive another entry, you will also receive a one gram Valcambi Swiss. So uh, let's get you an entry here. That's number 80. And once again, so every game winner and every random comment pick, uh, comment pick selection will receive a one gram Valcambi Swiss. However, if you win an auction item, you will not win a one grammar for every auction item you win. So I just wanted to clarify that. It's only for the random comment picker and the games. All right. So uh, congratulations, Chris. Let's pull two more names here. And it's a creepy, freaky Friday in the apartment building. I'm hearing screaming of all sorts. <laughs> and the winner is Dennis Stewart. All right, Dennis, congratulations. Uh, we are going to uh, also select one more name, and we will give you guys the uh, entries. And Rockzilla. Congratulations, Dennis and Rockzilla. All right, Dennis, your entry is number 46. And Rockzilla, your entry is number 85. 
Congratulations. And good luck on the jackpot prize. All right, guys, we're going to move on here to item number six. So I hope you guys are warmed up with the entree, with the appetizers, because we're moving on to the entree menu. So let's get going here. We have a toner alert for the first item. This is a 1964 Kennedy half dollar with a toned obverse. So the reverse is not toned at all, but the obverse is, and very nicely toned, I might add. We have hidden at five, Rafe at nine, hidden at 10, Patriot Stacker at 11, just edging out TJ. Maximus says, tone to the bone. Da -na 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 -na. Add to the bone. And we have Patriot Stacker at 11. Randy coming in at 12. Randy at 12. Looking for 13, 13. Do we have 13? And we have a couple of toners uh, on tonight's auction as well. 1964. Kennedy half dollar from Denver. And it is weird that it's toned on one side, but it's not the first time I've seen something like that happen. I've actually seen quite a bit of it. That's like jewelry box toning. We have Randy at 12. Going once. And Patriot Stacker coming in at 13 now. Patriot at 13, looking for 14, 14. Do we have 14? Randy fires back at 14. Sean says, must have been in a book or something with one side exposed to air. Exactly. So uh, probably could have been face down on a, um, on a jewelry box or exactly what you mentioned. We have Randy at 14. Going one. Going twice now. Randy at 14, looking for 15 for the toned obverse of a 1964D Kennedy half dollar. All in. All out. Last call. And... So to Randy for $14. Congratulations, Randy. You get the toner alert. Very cool toner at that. And you will also receive jackpot entry number six. So congratulations, Randy. We will add that to your wallet. What's going on? Silver Sacks is in the building, everybody. Good to see you, brother. Your frenemy is already at it. He threw a barber quarter into your wallet. What's in your wallet? We are not sponsored by Capital One. However, Capital One, if you would like to contribute to the channel, we will gladly accept payment. All right. Next up. This is pretty cool. This is a banknote, which it's been a while since I put a banknote on the auction. So I had to make sure to get one. Lot number seven is a 1922 Austria 1,000 Kronen banknote. And this is the condition that you can expect here. We have hidden at five, Adam at five and a half. And you can see me in the reflection slightly with something similar on my head. We have hidden at seven now. And here is the other side, the reverse here. Hidden at seven and a half. Seven and a half, looking for eight now. Going once. Going twice now. We have hidden at seven and a half for the 1,000 Cronin banknote. And we have a sniper alert. Sharp eye for coins has a sharp eye for bills because he's coming in at an $8 bid. 
$8 looking for nine now. And hidden is out. Sharp eye at eight. Going wands. Going twice now. Sharp eye at eight, looking for nine. All in, all out. Last call. And sold to Sharp Eye for coins for $8. Congratulations, Sharp Eye. That's your first win of the night, and you will receive jackpot entry number seven. Very nice banknote there from 1922. All right. So we are going to just tag it with your name on a note, and we will apply it to the bill as such. All right, we're going to keep things rolling along here. We've gained a little bit of momentum. And next up is item number eight. And we've seen these before, but we can't get enough of them. I sure can't. A one gram Geiger silver square. Once again, that's a one gram Geiger silver square. Starting bid here is $1. We have Adam at five, Rafe at six. Adam at seven, Gibby at eight. Gibby at eight, look over nine, nine. Do we have nine? Patriot Stacker taking it to 10 now. 10, look over 11, 11. Do we have 11? I mean, this is a little smaller than a SIM card. But doesn't that look like a chip that has to be kept out of the wrong hands? Very high end. We have Patriot at 10. Going once, going twice now. Patriot at 10, looking for 11 for the one gram Geiger square. All in, all out. Last call. And So to Patriot Stacker for $10. Congratulations, Patriot Stacker. But we're going to roll the price back here. We're going to roll it back to $8. Buy it now. But, guys, there are only 10 available. So the first 10 will get in on this. Buy it now at $9. Uh, excuse me, $8. $8 price point. We have TJ buy it now one. We have Addicted buy it now one. We have Gibby buy it now two. We have Chris buy it now one. Patriot Stacker buy it now one. And Henry. Uh, so Patriot, that means you will receive two in total. Just confirm that for me, please. And you will receive an entry for the additional item that you picked up here. So Henry with buy it now one. And we have Rebel Randy with a buy it now two. So let's see here. We don't have many buy it nows today, but this is definitely one of them here. So let's see. TJ Addicted. Both buy now one. We have Gibby at a buy now two. We have Chris with a buy now one. Patriot Stacker with a buy now one. Uh, uh, Henry V buy now one. And Rebel Randy buy now one. One, two, four, six, seven, nine. We have one more if anyone else is interested. All right. So congratulations to Patriot Stacker. You will receive jackpot entry number eight. You will also receive jackpot entry number 42 that's 42 there and we will add that to the jackpot box uh 
All right, let's get the entries for everyone else now. What's going on? Mug Swat is here. It is a freaky, creepy Friday night, and we are hanging out. We have a 35 lot auction tonight, including gold, silver, and low mintage world coins. Thank you for joining us, Mug Swat. And uh, so, TJ, you will get entry number 70. Addicted, you'll get entry number 63. Gibby, you will get entry number 52 and number 38. Chris, you'll get entry number 45. Henry, you'll get entry number 49. And Rebel Randy, you will receive entries number 92 and 53. That's 92 and 53. And here are the entries. What's going on, Kellen? Good to see you, Kellen. All right, let's get into item number nine here. We have a W, 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 W. And Rebel Randy says, buy now one for Rockin' Roots. All right, Rockin' Roots. Sorry I missed you there. Rockin' Roots. We'll get you a buy it now one, and your entry will be number 58. Good luck. All right, so here is the W. It's a Salt River Bay W quarter. And we have Henry at two, Brad at five. Brad at five, looking for six, six. Do we have six? And of course, it has the V75 privy on it as well. Definitely in, in uncirculated condition. We have Breeze at seven, Henry at eight. Henry at eight, Brad taking it to 10 now. 10, look for 11, 11, do we have 11? And I have yet to find a W quarter uh, for 2020 as far as the uh, V75s. So all that I've obtained were either through donation rolls from other channels, such as Mickey Robs Banks, who has been finding them at an incredible rate. Shout out to Mickey. I also received a couple of W's from our friend Silver Fish, which was very nice of her. We have Breeze at 11. 11, look at 12 now. Going. Wow, Henry says, I'm at 43 W's. That is impressive, Henry. Good job on the finds there. Going twice now. Three's at 11. All in. All out. Last call. And so to Breeze for $11. Congratulations, Breeze. You can't be mad at that price point. Not one bit. And you will also receive jackpot entry number nine. All right, Breeze. And let's add that to your wallet. And it is in there. All right. Next up, we have item number 10. This is a 1986 S clad proof Liberty half dollar. Starting bid here is $1. We have hidden at one, Rafe at six. Rafe at six, looking for seven now. This is a clad proof commemorative half dollar from 1986. And we have Rafe at $6. Rafe at six, look at the seven, seven. Do we have seven? And once again, we have three goodie bags here for the end of stream giveaway. One coin in each bag. We have Rafe at six going 
Swans and Jade Corona taking it to six and a half here. Six and a half, looking for seven. Ray fires back at seven. Rock and Root says, be right back doing laundry. I actually knocked out some laundry a couple of hours ago, Rock and Roots. You should have seen the smile on Mrs. Blotha's face, I tell you. <laughs> we have Rebel Randy at 10. Rebel Randy at 10. Look at 11, 11. Do we have 11? Going. Wants. Going. Twice now. We have Rebel Randy at 10. Look at her 11 for the commemorative clad proof half dollar. All in. All out. Last call. And. Soul to Rebel Randy. Congratulations, Rebel Randy. You get that for $10. And we will add that to your wallet. You will also receive jackpot entry number 10 as well. Good luck. All right. Next up, we got a nice little rhythm going now, don't we, Dennis? Lot number 11 is a 1976S Bicentennial Silver Ike Dollar. Let's take a look here. Here's the condition of the coin. Notice it has a little, uh, some brush marks there. Not literal brush marks, but it looks like there was some friction there that caused uh, those marks on there. So please take note of that before bidding. What's going on, George Kendall? Good to see you, George. I like big bots, and I cannot lie. Welcome to the stream. We have Rebel Randy at nine now. For the 1976S Bicentennial Eisenhower Silver Dollar, this is 40% silver. We have Patriot Stacker at 10 now. Patriot Stacker at 10. Look at 11, 11. Do we have 11? For the Bicentennial Silver Ike. Going once. Going twice now. And we have a double snipe, but we have Spoon at 11. Duck for cover, everyone. Patriot Stacker fires back at 12 now. Without any hesitation, Patriot Stacker at 12. Look at the 13, 13. We have 13. Henry taking it to uh, so Henry, it is half dollar bids accepted up until the ten dollar price point. After ten dollars, we go one dollar intervals unless we are dealing with uh, one dollar face value lots of constitutional silver. We have Patriot at fourteen now, just edging out Henry. Silver Sack says, "Hey, you got some big bots there. I like big bots, and I cannot lie." We have Patriot Stacker at 14. Going once. Henry says, yes, sir, I'm new. <laughs> Going twice now. We have Patriot Stacker at 14, looking for 15. For the Bicentennial Ike Dollar, 40% silver. All in, all out, last call, and sold to Patriot Stacker. 
Once again, Patriot Stacker, that is his third victory tonight. Congratulations. $14, Patriot Stacker, and you will receive jackpot entry number 11. Congratulations on the win. All right. And next up is item number 12. Item number 12 is a BU 1943P Merc Dime. Dimes. And there is some nice toning on this one, guys. You can see it in the light. Absolutely gorgeous. So we're not getting the uh, full split bands here, but absolutely gorgeous eye appeal on this Merc Dime. We have TJ at 11 just edging out Breeze. TJ at 11, looking for 12, 12. We have 12. Breeze firing back at 12. Brad says, very nice, very, very nice, because three varies are definitely necessary to describe this coin. We absolutely love toners. We absolutely love dimes. And we absolutely love BU Constitutional Silver. And we have a combination in this coin here. So Breeze at 12. Going... Wands. TJ coming back at 13 now. Breeze firing back at 14. Back and forth they go. Back and forth they go. What's going on? Buck is in the building. And that's, speaking of Buck, we started this at a buck. And we have 15 items tonight that started at $1. We have Breeze at 14 looking for 15. Going. Wands. Going twice now. Breeze at 14. All in. All out. Last call. And oh my goodness, we have a TJ coming in at the very last millisecond there. TJ at 15. Oh, my goodness. That was close. And Breeze coming right back at 16 without even a flinch. Breeze at 16. Looking for 17 now. Silver Sax says, I can't wait to open my dimes. And Silver Sax, you got a great deal for that bankroll for sure. I hope you have some special finds in there as well. And we have TJ at 17 now. What a battle we have between Breeze and TJ for the 1943P Merc Dime with some very nice toning on it as well. Breeze at 18 now. Breeze at 18. Looking for 19, 19. We have 19. The battle of the night is right here, guys. The auction has officially started for lot number 12. We have TJ at 19, looking for 20. 19, looking for 20 for the BU Merc Dime. And Breeze fires back with the right hand at 20. Wraith has the popcorn. We're just missing one thing. A whole lot of butter. Where's the butter in the chat? We need some butter on that popcorn. We have TJ at 22 now. Adam says, I was about to say, and Breeze firing back at 23, TJ at 25 now, Clay has the beer, so I think we're all set, we have the beer, we have the popcorn with the butter, are we missing anything? We have TJ at 25 now for the 1943P Merc Dime in BU condition. Going... Wands. Going twice now. All in. All out. Last call. 
And... Sold to TJ for $25 in the battle of the night. Congratulations, TJ. Big shout out goes to Breeze and TJ for uh, taking part in the battle of the night so far. And uh, that's 25 for TJ, who's trying to rack up the uh, jackpot entries. You will receive jackpot entry number 12, and we will add this to your wallet. Congratulations, TJ. And usually it's very hard to fight off Breeze when it comes to the Merc Dimes. Breeze and I, we have a thing for the BU Merc Dimes, that's for sure. All right, next up is lot number 13. We have an 1893 Colombian, com uh, excuse me. Uh, yes, it is Colombian commemorative half dollar, a.k.a. Christopher Columbus. Starting bid is $1 here, and it comes in the snap lock case here. We have Alistair. What's going on, Alistair? Good to see you, brother. Hope all is well. And Chris at 9, Patriot at 10, Rafe at 11, Patriot coming back at 12 now. 12, looking for 13, 13, we have 13. Hidden, coming in, coming in at 15 now. Hidden at 15, looking for 16. Henry at 16. 16, looking for 17, 17, we have 17. It's a battle royal for lot number 13, the 1893 Christopher Columbus commemorative half dollar. Going once. And Spoon coming in at 17 now. Spoon at 17. Looking for 18. For the 1893. Christopher Columbus commemorative half dollar. Spoon at 17. Looking for 18. Going wants uh you and me both brad i have yet to find an 1892 going twice now we have spoon at 17 all in all out Last call. And so to Spoon for $17. Congratulations, Spoon. That is your first win of the night. You will receive jackpot entry number 13. And you will receive this very cool commemorative half dollar from 1893. All right, Spoon. And uh, we're going to make a note here. If you want to create a wallet account, you sure can. If not, we'll bag it and tag it and, and have it ready for ship. Uh, Clay says, uh, any snow there? We just warmed up enough to melt off the ice and snow. So we actually got... Uh, snow in upstate New York. It didn't quite get to the city, but Maximus told me that he did uh, get a little bit of snow today. So it's, a, it's about that time. All right, guys, before we get into the next lot, we're going to play uh, Guess That Candy game. So let's guess that candy. When you see my fist, you can begin. You need the brand. Oh, Gigi's going to do it. Gigi's going to do it. Come on, Gigi girl. Here we go. All right, come over here, Gigi, and just wrap your your hand so that they can see. Once you see the fist, you can begin. What brand is that candy? And maybe hang hang it out a little bit so that they can see a portion of it. All right, Gigi, do not blink. Do not blink. Isn't that what it is? Oh, yeah. We have a winner. We have a winner. Let's take a look, Gigi. Wait, let me see. Oh, yeah. Is that correct? Yeah. Yes, we have a winner. 
And the winner is, let's just verify that we didn't miss anyone prior to this person. All right, we have confirmation. Go ahead, Gigi girl. Where is it? Where is it? Right there. Oh, the winner is Sparkle Flare. Sparkle Sweetheart. Flare. Sweethearts is the correct answer. So Sparkle Flare, not only will you receive one jackpot entry, number 59, you will also receive a one grand Balcambi Swiss silver bar. Congratulations. So your entry is number 59, and then you'll get the one grand Valcambi Swiss as well. Every game winner and every random comment picker winner will receive a one gram Valcambi Swiss bar. However, if you do not have an active wallet account, you must claim it via email at soccerflothany at gmail.com. Now, if I have your shipping information, then you do not need to claim. So, Sparkle, you're good to go. Congratulations on the win. And we're going to move on to another pre-1900 coin here. So let's take a look. Lot number 14 is an 1877 Seated Liberty Dime. Starting bid is $1. We have Alistair at 2 So there you see the reverse. Uh, it, this is a circulated coin, as you would imagine, a pre-1900 but you can still see the one dime on there and uh, the details as well. We have hidden at 15. Hidden at 15. Looking for 16, 16. We have 16. Sharp eye for coins comes in at 18 now. 18 looking for 19. 18 looking for 19 for the 1877. We have sharp eye coins. At 18, going wands. Rock and Root says, imagine how many pockets that's been in. And that's what I always wonder when I see a coin from the pre-1900s. People used to walk around. And you know what? There's a, I looked up old coins from the pre-1900s, and, and the theory was that, uh, so we have Sharp Eye at 18. Are we getting a lag here? All right. All uh, right. All right, are we good? Give me a thumbs up, guys. I'm sorry. We have sharp eye for coins. Let's count it down. We have it going twice at 18 now. All in. All out. Last call. And so. To sharp eye for coins for $18. Oh my goodness. And TJ, you tried to snipe it at the very end. However, let's take a look at the instant replay. And here we go. So there you see the sold to sharp eye for coins. So unfortunately, TJ, you could not get that bid in time. In, in time. Uh, so I do apologize for that. However, congratulations to Sharp Eye for Coins. That is for uh, $18. Second win of the night. You will receive jackpot entry number 14 as well. Congratulations. Uh, so so the, the thought process was when you're dealing with Hold coins. You've seen a lot of hold coins from the pre-1900s. A lot of them would wear, a lot of people would wear it around their neck or around their waist because not everyone had pockets in their pants. That's how far back we're talking. All right. Next up is item number 15. Item number 15 is a 1982... George Washington, 250th anniversary, silver proof, half dollar. Face reveal, face reveal. Do you see the you see the veil on my head? I'm wearing a bridal veil, courtesy of Gigi. 
who allowed me to uh, to borrow her veil before tomorrow. We have hidden at five. Silver Shark kicking in the door at ten. Silver Shark at ten. Look at eleven. Hidden at eleven now. Hidden at eleven. Looking for twelve. Eleven. Looking for twelve. Twelve. Do we have twelve? Spoon coming in at twelve. Spoon at twelve. Looking for thirteen. Thirteen. Do we have thirteen? This is a 1982 George Washington 250th anniversary silver proof half dollar. We have Spoon at 12. Going once. And Patriot Stacker coming in at 13 now. Patriot at 13. Looking for 14, 14. Do we have 14? Let's wipe this down here. See if we can get it. A little clearer for you guys. There you go. A little bit better. We have Spoon at 14, just edging out Rebel Randy. Spoon at 14, looking for 15 now. Going. Wands. Going. Twice now. We have Spoon at 14, looking for 15. All in. All out. Last call. And. So. To Spoon for $14. Just edging out Rebel Randy there. So congratulations, Spoon. You get it for $14. You also received jackpot entry number 15. And we will add that to your uh, newly activated wallet. All right. Next up, we have another toner alert here, and this is absolutely gorgeous. If you were here on Tuesday, then you definitely uh, saw this up close and personal. This is a 1935 Austria five shilling silver coin, 0.835% silver here, 0.835 fine silver. And look at the towing on that. We have hidden at 20 now. Hidden at 20. Looking for 21, 21. Do we have 21? And look at the toning on that. Toner alert. Toner alert. TJ coming in at 20 now. There's also some edge riding, I believe, on this. Yes, there is. We have TJ at 22. For the beautifully toned 1935 Austria, five shillings. Going once. And Sean, 47, coming in at 23 now. Sean at 23, looking for 24, 24. Do we have 24? Beautiful design on the coin as well. Sean at 23 for the 1935 toner. From Austria. Going once. Going twice now. Sean 47 at 23 now. All in. All out. Last call and a sniper and TJ with the misdirection with a doop de doo and boom shots fired. TJ at 24 now, just edging out Randy. Sean is out. TJ at 24, just beating out Randy for the 1935 Austria five shillings. We have TJ at 24. 
going. Wow. Yeah, that's right, Randy. This is the twin toner. And Randy coming in at 25. TJ coming in at 26. Back and forth they go. Back and forth they go. That's right. If you saw this on my Instagram, I put it up as a toner Tuesday for the twin toners here. Randy is out. We have TJ at 26 now. Going once. Going twice now. TJ at 26, looking for 27. All in. All out. Last call. And so to TJ for $26. Congratulations, TJ. Absolutely gorgeous toner. And it is heading your way. You will receive jackpot entry number 16 for this win. And we will add this beautiful toner to your wallet. All right, TJ. What's going on? Kelly Ray is in the building. Good to see you, Kelly. Hope all is well. It is freaky, creepy Friday night, and I am wearing a zombie bride veil on my head. Please do not judge me. All right, next up is item number 17. Item number 17 is a very nice piece metal here, so let's pull it out. Nineteen seventy-four United Nations piece metal. This is sterling silver proof with a weight of 24.6 grams. We're going to start the bidding at 15, and we have Adam at 16, hidden at 20. Hidden at 20. Look, You can see the bridal, the bridal veil on my head in the reflection. I was not lying to you guys. We have hidden at 20. Uh, I do not have a COA, Adam. This is uh, just a raw... Uh, piece metal here. Hidden at 20. Going once. Going twice now. And we have Adam with a sniper alert. Duck for cover. Adam coming in at 21 now. Adam at 21. Looking for 22. 22. Do we have 22? Addicted says the ASC is getting a V75 mark. That is absolutely correct, Addicted. And I don't know what you guys are doing on November. Is it 5th? But uh, that's when the... Uh, New American Silver Eagles and Gold Eagles go up for sale. So I hope you guys can obtain one. We have Adam at 21. Going once. Going twice now. We have Adam at 21, looking for 22. All in. All out. Last call. And so to Adam Stacks for $21. Congratulations, Adam. You will take home the Peace Medal 1974 United Nations. Congratulations. What's going on? Ontario Stackers in the building. Good to see you. Thank you for joining us. And 
Adam, you'll get entry number 17 for your win. Let's add it to your wallet. Congratulations. All right, there it is, Adam, and it is in there. Whew, I am getting hot with this bridal this bridal uh, veil, so I'm going to have to take it off now. Say goodbye to the zombie bridal veil. Big shout out goes to Gigi Girl for allowing me to borrow it. All right, so let's take a look here. Silver Sack says, what's funny is my boss thinks I'm working on November 5th, but the internet is faster at work for my chance. That's right, guys. Position yourself accordingly because uh, speed does matter. All right, next up is lot number 18. And, guys, this is accompanied by the COA. Very cool metal here, guys. Dropping the gold. Dropping the gold. So here we have it. Some toning on the obverse and on the reverse here. Kelly Ray says, let your hair down, Saka. I wish, I wish if I only had hair to let down. We have hidden at 25, sharp eye at 26 now. So this is a 1971 Franklin Blunt Limited Edition Sterling Silver Metal, and it is a proof. The weight is 27 grams. And it also comes with the uh, COA. We have Sharp Eye at 26 now. Going once. And Spoon coming in at 27 now. And notice this was uh, postmarked in Philly. Six cent, six cent uh, UK and the American flag here as well. Eight cent there. I wish those were still the prices of the stamps. We have Spoon at 27 now. Going once. Going twice now. We have Spoon at 27. All in. All out. Last call. And so to Spoon for $27. Congratulations, Spoon. Very nice pickup here. And you can't be mad at the toning that's already developing on this coin. Very cool. Congratulations. You will also receive entry number 18 for a chance to win the end of stream soccer block, the jackpot. We have three goodie bags. Uh, there is a coin in each goodie bag. One is a one ounce silver. The other two each have a one ounce copper courtesy of Dennis Stewart. So big shout out to Dennis for that. And uh, Spoon, congratulations. All right. Next up. And this one was a hard one to put on the uh, tonight's auction, but we are doing it. It is number 19, our 1921 Venezuela five Bolivars, 90 percent silver with a mintage of half a million on planet earth and a weight of 25 grams 
We started the bid at a low $20. We have Rafe at 20, hitting at 25. Silver Sacks at 26, just edging out Rebel Randy. Very, very cool coin here. Great details. There you see, I'm not seeing much damage on this coin. It is circulated. What's going on? Lambo Stacker kicking in the door at 29. TJ coming back at 30. TJ at 30. Looking for 31, 31. Do we have 31? 40, 19, 21 P. Venezuela. Low mintage. Five Bolivares. So we have TJ at 30. Just edging out Silver Sacks. Going once and silver sacks coming in at 31 now. Silver sacks at 31. Looking for 32. 32. Do we have 32? I definitely love the foreign silver, especially the uh, larger foreign silver coins, they do tend to have lower mintage. Silver Sacks at 31, going once, going twice now, all in, all out, last call. And so to Silver Sacks for $31. And the reason we're, we're doing 31 here is because on my screen, I'm seeing TJ at 31st. So let's take a look at the instant replay for a chance to be completely transparent. So let's take a look here. So I did have TJ. First, and then Silver Sacks. That's why it came back with a $31 bid. So uh, congratulations, Silver Sacks. You get it for $31. Very cool coin heading your way. And uh, we're going to add that to your wallet. You will also receive jackpot entry number 19 for a chance to win the end of street. What's going on, zombie fighter? Zombie fighter, I was just wearing a zombie veil here, but I'm not getting married. I was just temporarily using my daughter's uh, Halloween costume. And who else is here? Bricks Labs is in the building. Dove Season is here. Thank you guys so much for joining me on this creepy, freaky Friday night, the Friday before Halloween. Whoever's planning on going out, trick-or-treating. Just be safe, be careful, and enjoy yourself. Next up, item number 20, a BU 2021 African wildlife elephant. Let's take a look at the uh, reverse here. We have hidden at 30. Silver Sacks says, so the wedding was a hoax. <laughs> well, you know what it is? The death certificate in terms of the zombies that are getting married, you can't have a marriage license while you have an active certificate. So uh, it becomes a little difficult, Silver Sacks. <laughs> we have Sharp Eye at 33, hidden at 34 now. Face reveal. Hidden at 34, looking for 35 for the one ounce African wildlife elephant 2021. Hidden at 34. Going once. Going twice now. 
And Rafe with a sniper alert, a double snipe here. We had Rafe followed by Sean, but Rafe fired first. We have Rafe at 35, looking for 36 now. Rafe just edging out Sean's bid at 35. Very cool elephant indeed, Hidden. I love the fact that they made that the focal point of the coin where you can really see the detail of the elephant. Very well done. We have Rafe at 35. Going wands. Going twice now. We have Rafe at 35, looking for 36. All in. All out. Last call. And so to Rafe Ailman for $35. Congratulations, Rafe. A beautiful 2021 African wildlife elephant is going in your wallet. And that is uh, $35. You will also receive jackpot entry number 20. All right, so let's uh, tag it here. Congratulations, Rafe. What's going on? Silverfish is in the building. Good to see you, Silverfish. Hope you're doing well. Glad you were able to make it nice and early. So I'm, I'm, I'm taking it that you are out of work. And everyone else that is out of work, sit back, relax. Get a snack, get a beverage of choice, and enjoy. We are going to move on to another brand new 2021 coin. This, my friends, is a 2021 one ounce roaring lion. And I was roaring as I said that. <clears throat> I don't know if you picked that up. We have Patriot Stacker at 25, hidden, taking it to 30 now. 30, looking for 31, 31. Do we have 31? Absolutely fierce looking line there on the obverse. And on the reverse, you have the queen. 2021. One thing I like about the Roaring Lion series is. You know, I'm not a big fan of having the queen on the coin. However, I mean, that's as close to a photograph as you can have. Impeccable detail. Do you see the uh, detail on the hair, Gigi? Mm -hmm. And on the crown there? Uh, yeah. Yeah, very good. Very cool coin. And it's cool because I, I know that not all crowns like are like, all together, like they have like little parts. Right, very detailed, specific parts there. And we have sharp eye at 31. Going once. Sharp eye at 31, looking for 32 now. Going twice now. And Rafe at 33 with a sniper alert. That's for cover, Gigi. Look out. Rafe from the clock tower. And that's how it's done with the vantage point there. Rafe at 33 now. Sharp eye coming back at 34. Then it says, yes, we noticed you were boring. Oh, I mean roaring. <laughs> I guess both, depending on who you ask. <laughs> we have Rafe at 35. Back and forth they go, back and forth they go for the one ounce 2021 Roaring Lion. Silverfish says, today is my last day of vacation and I just went to a live production of Rocky Horror Picture Show. Awesome. That sounds like fun, Silverfish. We have Rafe at 35. Going one. Going to 
Why is now? Oh, Len? Oh, loud sniper alert! Kelly Ray with the snipe from the clock tower there. Kelly at 36. We have Kelly at 36 looking for 37 now. Kelly at 36 for the 2021 Roaring Lion Silver Coin. What's going on? Chris B is in the building. Says, hello, Saka Blata. Told you I'm going to see what's going on over here. Well, don't judge us, Chris B. It gets kind of crazy on this creepy, freaky Friday night. But welcome to the stream. And we have Kelly Ray at 36 for the 2021 Roaring Lion. Going want <laughs> they're everywhere silver stacks the clock towers are everywhere going to twice now we have kelly at 36 all in all out last call and So to Kelly Ray for $36. Congratulations, Kelly. You will also receive jackpot entry number 21 for a chance to win one of the three prizes that we'll be giving away at the end of stream as Gigi carefully places my zombie bride, Hi. her zombie bridal hair, uh, bridal <laughs> veil. I wish it was hair. I think I just think I'm in denial, guys. <laughs> All right. The zombie bridal veil is back on the soccer block of Baldy. <laughs> All right. Congratulations, Kelly Ray. First win of the night, and you will receive jackpot entry number 21. And uh, let's tag it here. Once again, guys, we have three Halloween-themed coins on the auction, and we'll be giving away one at the end of the stream. All right, Kelly. Next up is item number 22. Item number 22 is another brand new, but this is 2021 here, uh, 2020, one ounce Cook Island. 2020 Cook Island. This is the Bounty Silver Coin. Four nines fine silver with a $1 face value. But do not trade this for $1. Don't do it. We have Sean at 30. Patriot at 31. Dove Season at 32. Sean 47 at 33 now. 33. Looking for 34. 34. Do we have 34? Yeah. Oh, yes, it is. And the uh, the ship there has a uh, what appears to be a poop like finish on it as well. Ooh. We have Sean at 33. Going once. And Hidden coming in at 35, just edging out D Dove. We have Hidden at 35, looking for 36 now. Sean is out. Kelly Ray coming in at 36. 36 looking for 37. For the one ounce. Cook Island's Bounty Silver Coin from 2020. And here on the uh, reverse we have the queen. Kelly Ray at 36. Going... Wands. Going to Weiss now. Kelly Ray at 36, looking for 37. All in. All out. Last call. And So 
to Kelly Ray for $36. Congratulations, Kelly, with a back-to-back -back win there at the same exact price point as well, $36. Congratulations, Kelly. You will also receive jackpot entry number 22. All right. Two very nice one-ouncers adding your way. All right, well, we have arrived at the first Halloween-themed coin of the night. This is a 2019 one-ounce Zombux Dying Eagle three nines fine silver round. This is from 2019. We have Hidden at 30, Patriot at 35, just edging out Wraith. We have Patriot at 35, looking for 36, 36. And this does have a currency of, of how many Zombucks? How many Zombucks are here? 50. 50 Zombucks. So wow. the currency of the apocalypse, you might want to use this. It seems like we may be very well on our way. We have, we have Patriot at 35. Going once. Going twice now. Absolutely, Patriot. These are very cool to have and hard to find. And we have a sniper alert. D-Dub coming in. From the grassy knoll, because Silver Sack says there's way too many clock towers around here. We have D Dub at 36, just edging out Chris B. Now, Chris B, we would love for you to participate. All we would need is for you to register. In order to do that, all you need is a one dollar refundable payment to Sakaplata NY at gmail.com. And that's just to have your uh, shipping info and to verify you have an active PayPal account. Uh, so if you would like to participate, we would love to have you. And uh, we have Patriot Stacker at 37 now. Patriot Stacker at 37. 37 looking for 38. Going wands. Sean says, I do most of my sniping from the third floor of the school book depository. <laughs> Too many libraries on the third floor. We have D Dub coming in at 38. D Dub at 38, looking for 39. Silver Huskies in the building on this creepy, freaky Friday night. How's it going, brother? Thank you for joining us. And we have Patriot Stacker at 39, just edging out Ozzy. Patriot Stacker at 39, looking for 40 here. And you know, when I encounter these coins, or should I say these rounds, I was not able to obtain any ever since. I've had these for quite a while. And uh, I was looking to see if I had more, but I just could not find them. We have D-Dub at 40, just edging out Aussie. D-Dub at 40, looking for 41 now. Uh, Dennis says, I can vouch for Chris B if that makes a difference. Absolutely, Dennis. Chris B, you are good if you're being vouched for, so that's that's perfectly fine. I just like to have the uh, at least the email on file. That way I know where I'm sending my uh, invoices to. We have Aussie at 42. Aussie at 42, look at 43. For the 2019 one-ounce Zombux Dying Eagle, which is 100% accurate in the description. It's kind of hard to even make out the eagle there, but there you see it. And we have Patriot firing back at 43. 43, looking for 44. 44, do we have 44? And D-Dub coming in at 45 now. This may be the battle of the night so far. We did have a very nice battle for the BU 1943 Merc Dime earlier today between Breeze and TJ. Now we have Ozzy and D-Dub going head-to-head. -head. Also, Patriot Stacker in the mix. 
So we have D-Dub at 45, looking for 46. Going once. And Ozzy Cobber coming in at 50. Ozzy at 50, looking for 51, 51. Do we have 51? Ozzy at 50, looking for 51. Going twice. Yeah, so this is one out of three Zombucks that we will have available. The design will get better as we go on. In my opinion, I may be wrong, but these three designs, regardless, are very cool. We have Ozzy at 50. All in. All out. Last call. And we have a sniper alert from the clock tower. Kelly Ray with a $51 bid right when I was entering. Sold. Unbelievable. That was a perfectly timed snipe for Kelly Ray at 51. The question is, will Ozzy fire back at 52? We will see. We have Kelly at 51 for the 2019 Dying Eagle one ounce silver round. Going one. Going twice now. Kelly Ray at 51. All in. All out. Last call. And Ozzy Cobber with the sniper alert. Go for cover. Shots fired, Gigi. Shots fired. Where was the snipe from this time, guys? The grassy no. Ozzy at 52, looking for 53. Going once. Going twice now. All in. And Kelly Ray with a sniper alert, and the voice is starting to fade. I will soon be sounding like a 12-year-old boy. And we have Kelly Ray at 53 now. Clay has the beer. Let's check that off the list. We have Rafe with the popcorn, but we're just missing one more thing. Where on earth is the butter? We have Kelly Ray at 53. There's the butter. Silver Sacks coming in the clutch with the butter there. You need the butter on the popcorn. We have Kelly Ray at 53 going once. Going twice now. Kelly Ray at 53. All in. All out. Last call. And so to Kelly Ray for $53. Congratulations, Kelly. A hard fought battle. Big shout out goes to Ozzy Cobber for engaging in such a head to head battle. But Kelly, you came out on top this time and you will receive jackpot entry number 23. That is three in a row for Kelly Ray as she's starting to gain some momentum here, guys. Very nice coin heading your way, Kelly. Congratulations. All right. Now, before we get into item number 24, let me just make sure that I have it here. Okay, we have it here. And Kelly Ray says, please send it to Reese. Boom! How generous is that? Kelly Ray, that is very nice of you. Shout out to Reese. 
We just got the Zombuts Dying Eagle, courtesy of Kelly Ray. So we're going to note here, give to Reese. And I will also include that in the uh, invoice, if that's what you prefer. And for those that are new, we do things uh, two different ways. Uh, if you want to pay during the stream via goods and services, you are welcome to do so. However, if I do not receive payment, I will just invoice you for the total within 24 hours of the stream. So uh, it doesn't matter to me. Whatever works best for you guys is completely fine. Whether you want to pay now or have an invoice sent to you, uh, either way is okay with me. Once again, Kelly Ray, very generous, and congratulations on the win. And Reese, congratulations on a very, very cool gift. All right, here we go. Next up is item number 24. We have a 2016 one ounce Libertad. Libertad. Uh, so I do prefer goods and services only because uh, you know it provides me with the shipping address and all the information. Uh, but friends and family is fine as well, as long as I have the shipping info. Uh, so we're going to start the bidding at 30 here. We have hidden at 30 for the 2016 one ounce Libertad. Libertad. And we have Sean at 31, Brad Burge at 32, D Dub at 35, Rafe at 36 now. We have TJ at 37. TJ at 37. Watch out, guys. TJ loves his Libertet. Libertet. This is a one ounce 2016 Libertad. We have TJ at 37. Going. Wow. Rock and Roots says, I love my little Libertad I won. And Rock and Roots, not only congratulations for that win, that is a lower mintage as well. I believe that was a 2019. Going to Weiss now. We have TJ at 37. Oh, Lynn. Oh. Out. Last call. And Catfish coming in, kicking in the door with a sniper alert at 38. Catfish coming in at 38. Just edging out Chris B there. That was a double snipe. Catfish at 38, looking for 39 now. Oh, Gigi's playing with some. Creepy slime, metallic slime in the background. Look out, guys. We have Catfish at 38. Going. Wongs. Going to Weiss now. We have Catfish at 38. Cool. Yeah, the, the Dying Eagle is uh, very, very cool. Then it's counting down here. And if we're back, just give me a heads up when we're back. Guess who's back? We are back. And we are live from New York, guys. We are live from... From New York and for those that are new or are not familiar with the stream we had a Sakalaga moment or uh, Saka 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 Laga is that right? I know Saka Laga moment there we do experience brief but momentary lag uh, periodically maybe once or twice during the stream so I do ask for your patience guys all we'll do is just Freeze where we're at, and we'll pick up and continue once we have clearance from the tower. Uh, so there we have it. We are back, guys. <laughs> and where were we? We have Catfish at 40. 
We have Catfish at 40, looking for 41 for the 2016 one ounce Libra Tad. Once again, guys, the lag only lasts for about uh, 15 seconds or so. So uh, feel free to hang around until it clear, uh, clears out. 2016 one ounce Libra Tad, Chris. We have Catfish at 40. Going once. US says laggy plopper. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> Laggy plopper. <laughs> we have Chris B at 41. Oh, is that Judy? No, I don't think that's a dad joke at all. That's actually pretty funny. Because lag, laggy, my stream is laggy at times. <laughs> we have Chris at 41 going once going twice now crispy at 41 looking for 42 and catfish with a sniper alert up for cover catfish at 42 now back and forth they go where it'll stop nobody knows we have Catfish at 42. Kelly Ray says, Saka Laga Plata. <laughs> catfish at 42. Going once. Going twice now. Catfish at 42. All in. All out. Last call. And sold to Catfish for $42. Congratulations, Catfish. But wait one second because we are going to roll the price back here significantly let's roll the price back to $36 and we're going to open this up to a buy it now so congratulations catfish that is $36 and we have patriot stacker with a buy it now one we have TJ with a buy now one. Spoon with a buy now one. Brad with a buy now one. Rafe with a buy it now one. Steph kicking in the door with a buy it now one. Welcome, Steph. Hope all is well. We have D Dub with a buy it now one. We have Chris B with a buy it now one. Every buy it now will receive one entry into the jackpot as well. So that is another method. There are three ways to enter the jackpot. Uh, if you win an in-chat game, if you if your name is selected from the random comment picker, or if you have a buy it now, or if you win an auction item. So uh, let's sort this out here. Let's recap here, guys. So Catfish, once again, that's $36. Congratulations on the win there. And uh, we have a buy it now. One for Patriot Stacker, TJ, Spoon, Brad, Rafe, Steph, D-Dub, and Chris B. All right, Catfish, we will start up a new wallet for you. And it is reloaded. Okay, I reloaded. So congratulations, Catfish. And let's get the entries for the buy it nows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight entries total. All right, here we go. So TJ, uh, excuse me. So Patriot Stacker, you will receive entry number 83. TJ, entry number 67. Spoon, entry number 36. Brad, entry number 66. Rafe, entry number 41. Steph, entry number 69. D Dub entry number 44 and Chris B entry number 39. So 
So here you go. Those are the entries. We're going to add that into the jackpot barrel, which is right here to the right of me. And good luck. All right. Next up here. Item number 25 is an AUBU 1946P Walking Liberty Half Dollar. 1946. And we will go over to buy it now at the end of the stream as well. And we have Rebel Randy at 34, hidden at 40 now. Hidden at 40, looking for 41. And Steph coming in at 41. Look at the details on the breast feathers, guys. We have one of these on just about every auction. And I cannot get tired at looking at the detail of this coin. We have Steph at 41. Going once. <laughs> Clay 37. <laughs> Cover your eyes, Gigi. <laughs> Going twice now. <laughs> we have Steph at 41. All in. All out. Last call. And so to see SM Steph for forty-one dollars. Congratulations, Steph. A beautiful walker heading into your wallet. All right, Steph. And Steph, you will receive jackpot entry number 25. Catfish, you will receive entry number 24 for your previous win as well. All right, Steph, congratulations. And guys, we are approaching the next Zombux coin of the night. This, my friends, is lot number 26, a 2019 one ounce Zombux Saint. This is three nines fine silver. And would you look at that? We have Patriot Stacker starting us off at 30. Rafe taking it to 35. Now hidden at 40. 40 looking for 41. Lambo at 42. We have Lambo at 42 there. Lambo at 42.0. 42.0. Do we have 43.0? We have Aussie at 50.0. 50.0 looking for 51.0. We have Aussie at 50 looking for 51 for the 2019. The Saint. Zombucks. Silver. Round. Such a cool coin, guys. You encounter coins like this, and it's very difficult to not hang on to it. I'll tell you that much. Ozzy at 50. Going once. Going twice now. Ozzy at 50. All in. All out. Last call. And we have a sniper alert, Kelly Ray. Am I having amnesia? Because I feel like Ozzy and Kelly went to battle for the first Zombucks. 
We have Kelly Ray at 51 now. Silverfish says, did you have the great fortune to get a hold of Queen Tribute coins? So, Silverfish, I have not been able to obtain them. But I did see the one that you obtained. Very, very nice. And the Gigi would love a coin like that. So, I got to keep an eye out. We have Ozzy at 52. Ozzy at 52, looking for 53 here. Going once. Impeccable detail. The saint is standing on a pile of skeletons. That is just very cool. Going to Weiss now. We have Ozzy at 52. All in. All out. And we have a sniper alert. Kelly Ray coming in at 53. Back and forth they go, and Ozzy returns fire with $54 bid. Back and forth they go, a head-to-head -head battle here. This is part two of their battle tonight, and we have Ozzy at 54. Going once. Going Twice now. And Kelly Ray bumping it to 55 with a sniper alert. And the voice is fading here. The voice is fading. And we are only on item number 26 out of 35 items tonight. We have Kelly at 55. TJ brings the beer, the popcorn. But where on earth is the butter? Where is the butter? What's going on, Shannon Smith? We have Kelly at 55. Going wands. There's Patriot Stacker with the butter. Is it organic butter? Is it... I can't believe it's not butter. Going twice now going going twice kelly ray at 55 all in all out last call and so to Kelly Ray for $55. Congratulations, Kelly Ray. Another hard-fought victory. And we are going to put you down here, 55. And you will receive jackpot entry number 26. Very, very cool. What another exciting battle. And Shannon Smith, I do still have your package here. So if you end up winning anything tonight, shipping will not only be free, but if I did charge you shipping on your previous package, then we will deduct the shipping cost from any purchases you make tonight. So FYI, Shannon Smith, just giving you that option. If that's something that interests you, that's fine. If not, either way, we're going to send that package out tomorrow. All right. Kelly Ray with the win. And that's Kelly Ray's fourth win tonight. And Kelly Ray says, send it to Jonathan. Happy birthday. Is it Reese's birthday? Uh, <clears throat> me, me, me. <laughs> Jonathan, is it your birthday? Because I have a special treat for you if it is. That's cool. <laughs> so we're going to make a note here. Give to Reese. November 9th is his birthday. So he will escape the birthday wrath. 
he just he just, Dennis, tell him what he just avoided. <laughs> Bloody eardrums, because that's what happens when we start singing here on the Soccer Blapa channel. <laughs> All right, uh, so we're going to give the entry to Reese as well. That's entry number 26. All right. Next up is item number, let's see, TJ says, hit it anyway. It's someone's birthday today somewhere. Happy birthday to whoever's birthday it is. Happy birthday to you. Eek. <laughs> All right, next up is the second Libertad of the night. This is a 1984 one ounce Libertad, Libertad, Libertad. And we have Patriot Stacker starting us off at 32. TJ taking it to 37 now. 37 looking for 38, 38. Do we have 38? EMP at 40. We have EMP at 40. EMP, we have you at 40. I think EMP wants it. EMP at 40, looking for 41 now. Going once. Going twice now. EMP at 40. All in. All out. Last call. We have a sniper alert. Catfish coming in at 44. Catfish with the perfectly timed snipe there. We have Catfish at 44. Looking for 45. And EMP coming in at 45 now. 45. I think one bit at a time will do EMP. We have 45. Looking for 46. EMP at 45. Going once. Going twice now. All in. All out. Last call. And so to EMP for $45. Oh, and TJ tried to come in at the end with a snipe, but we are sold at $45. However, we are going to do a roll it back. So we're going to roll back the price point. So it's not going to be $45. It is, however, going to be $37, and we have five remaining for a buy it now. $37 for EMP, and we have Steph with a buy it now one. Catfish with a buy it now one. Patriot Stacker with a buy it now one. TJ with a buy it now one. We have one more remaining. One more remaining. Uh, sure, EMP, I can definitely pick up a capsule for the uh, one ounce lead. And Chris B gets the final Libertad. So we have Catfish, TJ. Patriot Stacker and Chris B. And uh, fortunately, DW, we are sold out of the 1984s. Uh, but if you want a 2016, I think I have you here for a 2016 already. Yeah, I do. So if you wanted to turn that into two, that's up to you. But we are sold out of the 1984s. So that's a buy it now one for, we're going to recap here. Buy it now one for Steph, Catfish, TJ, Patriot Stacker, and Chris B. That's at the $37 price point. 
Uh, I believe so, Steph. Uh, Vieira, one thing that he has massive amounts of, besides low mintage coins, he has a great amount of wholesale supplies. So if you guys are looking for capsules, if you're looking for tubes, flips, you name it, he has them. Uh, yes, yeah, so Rafe, the last one was at 36, but I, I would like to ask that we hold that till the end. That way, uh, because if, if uh, we put you down for another one, we may have an avalanche of more by now. So, uh, okay, so let's get you guys the entries. That's five entries total. The first entry is Steph at 76. Catfish, your entry is 91. TJ, your entry is 97. Patriot, your entry is 72. And Chris B, your entry is 89. And just to clarify for those that are new, if it doesn't have an underline, it's a nine. If it has an underline, it has a six. It is a six, should I say, if it's underlined, that is. All right. Uh, let's see here. So, EMP, you'll get jackpot entry number 27 for your win. Congratulations. You know what I should do is do a uh, a bin battle for supplies at, at Vieira's shop maybe one of these days. Put a one in the chat if that's something you'll be interested in. Uh, he has boxes and boxes of all different kinds. Of, uh, he even has, uh, uh, let's say you need bezels for your coins. He has those as well. Uh, coin bezels are uh, oh, jewelry yeah. pendants. That yeah. You, yeah. yeah. Oh, my goodness, your hands. <laughs> what happened to your hands, CG? <laughs> Don't worry. I'm going to wash them. <laughs> and EMP has just put VRCoins.com on there. He has – hold on, guys. I have to stress this because this is big. So thank you. EMP for bringing that up. Check this out, guys. You want low mintage coins. Vieira Coins has one of the lowest mintage coins I've ever heard of. Only 100 of these coins were minted on planet Earth, and I am going to show you exactly what that coin is. He is putting it for sale, my friends. He is putting it up for sale. This is a Vladimir Lenin, 1977 Cuba. Only 100 on planet Earth. So if you are interested, I believe he's asking around 2,000 for the coin. But it is absolutely gorgeous. So make sure you guys uh, hop over to Vieira Coins. Show him some love, and uh, that coin is special. That coin is absolutely special. All right, let's move on to a low mintage coin alert. Next up is item number 28. Item number 28 is a 1938 Canadian silver dollar 80 percent silver this has a mintage of ninety thousand three hundred and four on planet earth that is a super low mintage for a canadian silver coin and we are starting the bid at thirty dollars we have hidden at thirty We have hidden at 30, looking for 31. Dove season taking it to 32 now. Hidden at 33 now. And guys, if you look this up on NGC or PCGS, you'll see what they're going for. Chris B says, I'm going for the November 5th gold. Absolutely. You and me both, Chris. Good luck on that. I hope that as many of us can obtain it as humanly possible. We have hidden at 33 for the 1938 Canadian dollar, 80% silver, mintage of 90,304. Hidden at 33 now. 
going once. Dennis says, no Canadians here. I'm from the Great White North. So is that what you call it, Dennis? <laughs> we have Hidden at 33 going twice now. Hidden is about to get a steal, my friends. Hidden at 33, looking for 34 for the 1938 Canadian silver dollar. All in. All out. Last call. And sold to Hidden for $33. Congratulations, Hidden. And the crowd goes wild. What an incredible deal on a super low mintage 1938 Canadian silver dollar. How cool is that hidden? That is awesome. You will get entry number 28 and a low mintage 1938 Canadian silver dollar. That is awesome. Hidden, we're going to add that to your wallet. Incredible. Very, very cool. And it is in there. How about that? What a great deal. And you get some great deals on, on the auction from time to time, guys. And whenever I'm able to, if I have multiples, I try to roll the prices back as frequently as possible. You have to spread the silver goodness to as many people as possible. All right, before we move on to the next one, we're going to play another game. Come over here, Gigi. Yeah. All right. Guess that candy brand. Guess that candy brand. There is a clue there. First person to guess correctly will gain three entries into the jackpot and a one grand Volcambi Swiss. Oh, oh, we have a winner. We have a winner. Stop, stop in the name of love. Stop. Drop, open up shop. Oh, we have a winner. <laughs> and let's take a picture to be completely transparent. We have a winner, guys. All right. And the winner is? Jules G. Jules G. Nerds was the correct answer. You just edged out Steph for that win. And here is confirmation there you see it Jules nerds is the correct answer so congratulations Jules you will receive three entries into the jackpot wait hold on one second was oh uh, you know what actually I do have to correct that that's one entry the three entries was regarding uh the costume outfit that I had at the beginning of the stream. So you actually get one entry, but you'll also get a one Grand Valcambi Swiss. So I do apologize for the blunder there. But Jules, you have been entered into the jackpot regardless here. You will receive jackpot entry number 90 and a one Grand Valcambi Swiss. And we will add that to your wallet. <laughs> Spoon says someone's going to need a dentist. I think we're going to need a lot more than that. <laughs> All right. So congratulations to Jules. Your number is 90, and you get the one gram Val can be added to your wallet as well. Is your candy stash? Oh, my goodness. This is the candy stash here. This is just the leftover. We made, like, a bunch of goodie bags and everything. That's right. We did make a bunch of goodie bags for the, for the children at the, at the schools. And whatever's left, we're hiding from each other. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So let's move on to item number 29, the final Zombux coin on the auction. We will be giving away a one-ounce mystery silver coin at the end of the stream. And this is it right here. This is the coin that is up for grabs on the auction. 
2018 one ounce Zombucks starving silver round. And we have Adam Stacks at 32. And this, out of all of the designs, might be my favorite one. And once again, I really had to convince myself and work myself up to putting this on the list tonight. How cool is that? I guess it's a reminder. Seeing starving on the coin reminds me of how uh, how tough it was, you know, for my family growing up, and or for me when I was uh, a kid. And uh, I think many of you guys could probably relate. So here it is, a 2019. It says 2018 on the list, but it's actually a 2019 one ounce. And we have Ozzy at 43. Ozzy at 43, looking for 44. Patriot at 45 now. Patriot at 45, looking for 46. 46, do we have 46? Patriot just edging out crispy. What's going on? Hey, hey, Ron Autry's in the building. That's a fun name. Hey, hey, Ron Autry, thank you for joining us. We have Patriot at 45 and Ozzy coming in at 49 now. Ozzy at 49. What's going on? Gold miners in the building. Good to see you, brother. It is a freaky, creepy Friday night. Tis the night before Halloween. And we have Ozzy at 49. And I'm glad you're enjoying yourself, Chris B. It is great to have you guys joining me this Friday night. We have Ozzy at 49 going once. Going twice now. And Kelly Ray with the sniper alert. That's for cover. Kelly at 50 now. Kelly at 50 looking for 51 for the one ounce Zombucks starving silver round. Kelly at 50, going once, going twice now. We have Kelly at 50, looking for 51 for the starving silver round. Oh, and, and we have a sniper alert, Ozzy Carter, coming in at 51. Kelly Ray taking it back to 53 now. Back and forth they go. Oh, and Kelly has retracted. Kelly has retracted. So we have Ozzy at 51, Kelly at 52 now. So we have Kelly at 52, looking for 53. And Ozzy and Kelly have been going head-to-head -head on these Zombuck coins. This is round three of their epic encounter. And we have Ozzy at 53 now. Ozzy at 53, looking for 54. Back and forth they go, back and forth they go. And guys, these are not easy to find. I've had these for a couple of months now. I've been looking to get more because I wanted to keep a couple for myself. They are not easy to find. We have Kelly at 54 now. Ozzy coming back at 55. For the last Zombucks coin of the night, other than one we will be giving away. We have Ozzy at 55. And Kelly coming in at 56. TJ brings in the popcorn, the butter, and the beer. And Patriots bringing, what are those frogs? I cannot tell what that emoji is, but it looks pretty awesome. We have Kelly at 56, Ozzy at 57. Back and forth they go, back and forth they go. Oh, zombies. That makes sense. That one flew right over my head. I should have, I mean, the color pretty much made it clear, but we have Ozzy at 61. Back and forth they go. Ozzy Cobber at 61. Going. Wands. Kelly Ray at 63 now. Back and forth they go. Back and forth they go. The SLQ design is beautiful to begin with, but what a nice twist on it as well. We have Ozzy at 64. Kelly coming back to 
the right hand at 65. 65 looking for 66. Do we have 66 for the 2019 one ounce Zombucks starving? And Ozzy returns fire at 66. Ozzy at 66, looking for 67 now. Back and forth they go. Kelly Ray taking it to 67. Back and forth they go. What a battle we have here. Can you feel the electricity? The suspense. The anticipation. We have Ozzy at 68 now. Back and forth. The battle of the night. And Kelly. Kelly, I'm not sure if that's a typo, but confirm your bid, please, because I am seeing a $79 bid. All right, we have Kelly with the retraction there. And Kelly coming in at 69. We have Kelly at 69, looking for 70. 69, looking for 70. Oh, you can feel it in the air, guys. Ozzy returns fire at 70. Boom! Wow, this is amazing. We have Ozzy at 70, looking for 71. Kelly coming back at 71 now. 71, looking for 72. Do we have 72 for the 2019 one ounce starving silver round battle of the night right here for item number 29? And item number 30 waiting in the wings is a 1975 Bahamas chunky one. We have Ozzy at 72 now. When will they stop? No one knows, but they are fighting to the death for the starving silver round. Kelly bringing it to 75 now. 75, and Ozzy is out. The suspense. The anticipation. Kelly at 75. Going... Once going twice now. All in, all out. Last call and. $75. Congratulations, Kelly. What a hard-fought battle there. You cleaned house on all the Zombucks tonight. Unbelievable. That was the battle of the night right there. Can we get a round of applause for that epic trilogy between Kelly, Ray, and Ozzy Cobber? Shout out to both individuals for their hard-fought battle there. Wow. Kelly Ray. How exciting was that? And Kelly, we will add that to the collection that you're developing here. Incredible. All right. Next up is the final item of the entrees before we head into the dessert menu. And this is a chunky one, my friends. And it is a low mintage alert. This is a 1975 Bahamas $10 face value. This is sterling silver with a mintage of 63,000 on planet Earth, a weight of 49.1 grams. This is starting under melt value here. We have Brad at 35, just edging out dub season. We have Lambo at 36 now. Lambo at 36, Brad at 37. That's currently melt. We have Brad at melt value for the $10 Bahamas coin. And we have Patriot Stacker at 40, just edging out Lambo and dub. Brad taking it to 42 now. 42, looking for 43, 43. Do we have 43? Chunky indeed. 49.1 grams of sterling silver with a mintage of 63,000. We have Chris B at 46 now. 
Chris B at 46, Dub at 47. Dub at 47, looking for 48, 48. We have 48. Dub at 47. Chris returns fire at 48 now. 48, looking for 49, 49. Do we have 49? Steven Parsons kicking in the door with a $49 bid. What's going on, Steven? Good to see you. Hope all is well. We have Steven at 49, looking for 50. Dove is out, but Chris fires back at 50. Chris at 50 for the 1975, $10 Bahamas, sterling silver coin. Chris at 50, looking for 51, 51. Do we have 51? That's right, Brad. Reed is no, normally all over the uh, Bahamas or the Jamaica silver coins. We have Chris B at 50 going once. Going twice now. Chris B at 50. And Dub Season with the sniper alert. Dub Season, very sneaky. He said, out, not so fast. I'm back in at 51, just edging out Kelly Ray as well. We have Chris coming in at 52 now. Chris at 52, just edging out Kelly. Chris at 52, looking for 53 now for the $10. Bahamas, 1975, mintage of 63000 on planet Earth. Catfish says, payment sent back to drinking my Budweiser. All right, Catfish, you enjoy. Don't forget the popcorn and the butter. And thank you for the payment, brother. We have Chris B at 52. I do apologize for any technical difficulties, Kelly. Chris B at 52. Going once. Going Twice now. We have Crispy at 52. All in. All out. Last call. And So to Chris B for $52. Congratulations, Chris B. I believe that's your first win on the Sock of Lava World Coin Auction. So congratulations, Chris B. We're going to put you down here for $52. And you will also receive jackpot entry number 30 for a chance to win the end of stream. We have three prizes, three goodie bags. And each goodie bag is a one-ounce coin. Two of them have one ounce copper. One has one ounce silver. And the first name selected at the end of the stream will have a choice to choose which bag they believe the silver's in. And uh, so congratulations, Chris B. Let's bag it and tag it. What's going on? Ah, yes, is in the building, everybody. International Stacker is here. Thanks for joining us, brother. Oh, it's time for the crab attack. Let's make it rain crabs here. Ah, yes, is in the building. Now, before we get into the dessert menu, we're going to pull the random comment picker here and select three more names. Each of these names will also take home a one grand Valcambi Swiss silver bar along with their entry. What's going on, Charles? Kelly is here. Good to see you, Charles. All right. That's what I'm talking about. It's a, it's a freaky, creepy, crabby Friday night. And let's pull up the random comment picker. If you guys haven't yet commented, here is the link. It has been a very exciting auction so far. Such great battles. Before we get into the main event of the evening, let's refresh here. We're going to pull three names to enter the jackpot here. 
Here we go. Good luck. And the winner is for the third time tonight, Chris Brummett. Chris, you will also get a third one grand Val Camby, and you'll get jackpot entry number 71 here. How about that, Chris Brummett? All right, let's select two more here. The random comment picker loves Chris tonight, that's for sure. And the winner is Gold Miner. Gold Miner says, Freaky freaking Friday on a Blue Moon Halloween weekend. Let's go! We are fired up and wired up, although I'm not drinking any ginger ale tonight. Good thing, because if I had a ginger ale, I would be busting through the roof, I think. So, Chris, uh, excuse me, uh, Gold Miner, you'll get the one grand Val Camby, and you'll get. Entry number 100 into the jackpot. And let's do one more. And the winner is Kelly Ray. So, Kelly, you will receive jackpot entry number 93. And you will receive a one grand Valcambi Swiss silver bar. Congratulations. All right, guys. Well, we are now entering the dessert menu for tonight. And if you don't know about this item, this item is a 1917 Type 1 Standing Liberty Quarter. And the starting bid is $35. 1917. For the SLQ, we have Silver Sacks at 36 now. Silver Sacks at 36, looking for 37. This is lot number 31 for tonight. Look at the detail on this coin. We have Stephen Parsons coming in at 37, Dennis Stewart at 38 now. Silver Sags at 39. We have a triple threat battle here for the 1917 Type 1 SLQ. I released a video on how I was able to obtain this coin. If you, if you have yet to see that video, please check it out. And uh, it should be one of the recent videos. We have Silver Sacks at 44, Dennis Stewart at 45. Back and forth they go. The frenemies going to war here for the 1917 Type 1 SLQ. We have Dennis at 50 now. Dennis at 50, looking for 51, 51. Do we have 51? EMP says, how do you like the Khabib scrap? I tell you what, EMP, I really thought Justin had the best chance to win out of anyone. And it looks to me... Like, Khabib is the man, without question. How could you deny it after that performance? We have Dennis at 58. It is a free-for-all, a battle royal for the 1917 Type 1 SLQ. Uh, one thing's for sure. You know, we can say what we want about Conor McGregor's personality, his attitude or whatnot. Him and uh, La Quinta were really the uh, hardest fights for Khabib. Not saying much because he's undefeated, but we have Silver Sacks at 65 here. The front of me battle, they're going head to head here. Silver Sacks at 66 for the 1917 SLQ Type 1. And Ozzy has the popcorn and the butter. We're just missing one more thing. What a battle this is. We have Silver Sacks here at 66. There it is. There it is. We are complete. <laughs> we have Silver Sacks at 66. Going once. Going twice now. We have Silver Sacks at 66. All in. 
All out. Last call. And so to silver sacks for sixty six dollars. Congratulations, silver sacks. The 1917 Type 1. Oh, and Dennis with the <laughs> with the sarcastic delayed snipe at the end. <laughs> Congratulations, Silver Sacks. That is incredible. Very cool coin. Silver Sacks says, I heard Dennis put a quarter in my wallet. You know I have to pay it back. Boom! Silver Sacks passing the 1917 Type 1 SLQ over to Dennis Stewart. How cool is that? So we will put that in Dennis's wallet, courtesy of Silver Sacks. How generous is that? Incredible. So let's add that to Dennis's wallet, courtesy of Silver Sacks. Very cool, brother. That is awesome. What's going on? Rare Find is in the building. Good to see Rare Find. All right. Next up is the first gold of the night. Item number 32 is a BU 2020 Canadian Maple Gram. Four nines fine gold. We're going to start it at 75 here, but these go for well over $80. Even with the price drop, the premium is pretty high on these. We have Lambo starting us off at 75 Hidden taking it to 80 now. We have Hidden at 80 looking for 81 Hidden at 80 looking for 81 Rafe says, this is the part of the auction where I just sit back and watch. <laughs> I hear that, Rafe. Either way, some great eye candy here. We have hidden at 80. Going once. Going twice now. We have hidden at 80, looking for 81 for the BU 2020 Canadian Maple Gram. All in. All out. Last call. And we have a sniper alert. The Cover Chris B getting it in on time. $82 snipe. Chris B. And let's take a picture here so that we can show you what I'm seeing on my screen. Because according to my screen, I am seeing a legit snipe here. Chris B at 82. Just before. The soul to hidden. We have Chris B at 82. Going once. Don't worry. You know what's going to happen here, hidden. Going twice now. Crispy at 82. All in. All out. Last call. And so. To Chris B for $82. However, we are going to roll the price back. 
So let's roll the price back to $80. So Chris B, that's $80. And we're going to open this up to a buy it now. We have nine remaining if anyone is interested. So Chris B, you'll get it for $80. And you'll also get entry number 32 into the jackpot. And we have Steph with a buy it now too. Steph with a buy it now too. So let's get Steph two entries here. Steph, you'll have entry number 74 and entry number 60. That's 74 and 60 for uh, Steph. And Steph says, put one into the EOS giveaway. Boom! Are you kidding me? Gold has just been added to the Saka Blata Jackpot end of stream giveaway courtesy of CSM Steph. And the crowd goes wild. Are you kidding me, Steph? Thank you so much for the generosity. That is incredible. One for giveaway. Unbelievable. So here are the two. We're going to snap one in half. One is for the giveaway for tonight. Oh, my goodness. Steph, you are incredible. Wow. So, Chris, I think, uh, Chris B., I think you wanted to buy it now, too. So that means a total of two. Just confirm, Chris, so I can get you down here for a buy it now, one. Uh, not including the one you won there. We have hidden with the buy it now one. Oh my goodness. And Mrs. Plata is in the building, everybody. The lovely, the beautiful Mrs. Plata has graced us with her presence. Hi, everyone. All right. She's here. And I and I see Chris B with two. Uh, so two total or Three total. I'm sorry, Chris. I just want to be. Uh, I want to make sure that uh, I have you down correctly here. So is that two total or three total? Uh, so we have hidden with the buy now one. This is a uh, so Adam. It's eighty dollars for the uh, one gram Canadian maple gram. All right, got you there, Chris. Perfect. All right, so that's what I had here. Uh, we're gonna put this in. Uh, Steph's wallet here, the uh, one gram gold. And Steph, thank you once again. That was very generous. Okay. How about that? So let's see here. So Steph, you have your two entries. Chris, let's get you one more entry. Number 79. And hidden number 47 for you, brother. Good luck. All right. So once again, congratulations to Chris, who won the auction item. Uh, I'm glad to hear that, Chris B. Thank you for tuning in. I'm glad you guys are, are enjoying yourself. I sure have a great time with you guys here. So I do appreciate your company. And next up is the first PL Morgan on my auction. And this is bittersweet for me. So it always is. But item number 33 is a PCGS graded MS63 PL 1885 oh Morgan silver dollar and the dude he says how could you and the starting bid here is seventy five dollars we have eight Oreos in front of you now there you see <laughs> you can have some. we have hidden starting us off at 75 here is the verification number if you need to uh type that into the pcgs website 75 dollars for the pl 
<laughs> are we getting uh oh, do we have any lag here? We have Ozzy at 76. What's going on? Nancy Barber's in the building. Silver Sacks at 77 now. Hidden at 78. I think we're on a slight lag, guys. If we do end up experiencing some lag, just hang around. It will clear up momentarily. We have Hidden at 78 now. Such a beautiful coin here. Silver Sacks at 79, just edging out Dennis Stewart. Ozzy coming in at 80, just edging out Hidden. We have Dennis at 81 now. Dennis at 81, looking for 82, 82. Do we have 82? Hidden taking it to 82 now. So I believe PCGS has this valued at around $125. That's book value. Uh, we have Silver Sacks at 83. Hidden coming in at 84 now. Hidden at 84, looking for 85. And we have Ozzy at 85 now. Back and forth they go. Hidden returns fire at 86. And you can feel the tension when we reach the dessert menu items. You can feel the suspense, the anticipation as we look at a gorgeous PL. We have Silver Sacks at 87, but his limit was 80. 87, but his limit was 80. Do we have 88, but his limit was 80? <laughs> we have Sacks at 87, looking for 88 now. For the 18850 MS63PL. Going one. Going twice now. We have Sacks at 87 here. Looking for 88 for the 1885-0 Morgan Dollar. MS63 proof like. And we have a sniper alert. Hit and made sure to get the dollar sign before the 88 digit. Very smart of hitting. That is a snipe. And hitting, you have it at 88 now. 88, looking for 89, 89. Do we have 89? And the whole soccer block of family is right here <laughs> next to me. Face reveal. Face reveal. <laughs> we have hidden at 88. And that's a veteran move. Hidden knew what happens when you just type 88 in chat. He made sure to avoid that issue what and we have hidden at 88 going once going twice now hidden at 88 and we have a sniper alert gold miner coming in from the grassy knoll and Hidden returns fire at 90. We have Hidden at 90, looking for 91. This is not over, guys. We have Hidden at 90. Silver Sax says, I'm out, so it's over for Sax for now. And we have Gold Miner firing back at 91. 91, looking for 92, 92. Do we have 92? It comes down to Hidden and Gold Miner, and Hidden is out. And Hidden, you came so close to having that, brother. Now Gold Miner here in the driver's seat. We have Gold Miner at 91. Going once. Going twice now. Gold Miner at 91 for the MS63 PL 1885 O Morgan. All in. 
all out. Last call. And so to gold miner for ninety one dollars. Boom! The first PL on the soccer plot the auction is going to gold miner. Congratulations, brother. And we will add that to your wallet. That's $91 for gold miner. And you will also receive jackpot entry number 33. Jackpot entry number 33 for gold miner. And that proof light is in your wallet. Gold Miner says, sorry, hidden first proof like ever. And I love Morgans and my birth year is 1985. So I had to, brother. Well, congratulations, Gold Miner, on the first proof like in your collection. And let's take a deep breath. Let's take a little woo because that was very tense. As we move on to item number 34. Item number 34 is face reveal, face reveal, a 2019 five ounce San Antonio Missions, three nines fine silver quarter. And the starting bid is at a low 145. We'll do $5 intervals. Absolutely gorgeous. We have Ozzy starting us off at 145 now. Ozzy at 145, looking for 150. So we do $5 intervals over 100, uh, Stephen. And we have Stephen at 150 now. Stephen at 150. Looking for 155. And we have Aussie returning fire at 155. 155 looking for 160 now for the 2019 five ounce San Antonio missions. Aussie at 155 looking for 160. Going. Wands. Going to Weiss now. We have Aussie at 155. All in. All out. Last call. And so to Ozzy Cover at one hundred and fifty five dollars. Boom! Congratulations, Ozzy Cover. You cannot be mad at that deal. Not one bit. Very good deal. Very sweet coin as well. And congratulations, Ozzy. Let's put you down here. We're going to add that to your wallet. That's 155. And you will receive jackpot entry number 34. Very, very cool. All right, guys. Well, now it's time for the main event of the evening. Item number 35 is an 1892 S $5 Liberty Head 90% gold coin. Now it is polished. 
but it has a lower mintage of 298,400 on planet Earth. We have Lambo at 480, just edging out Spoon. Silver Sax comes in at 485, edging out Spoon. And we have Spoon at 500, edging out Lambo. Hidden taking it to 525 now. Hidden at 525, looking for 530. Spoon coming in at 530. 530, looking for 535 now. So a better date, 1892S. And it is polished, but it is a uh, lower mintage. We have Spoon at 530. Going once. Going twice now. We have Spoon at 530. Looking for 535. The suspense. The anticipation. All in. All out. Last call. And so to spoon for five hundred and thirty dollars. Boom! And the crowd goes wild. Congratulations, Spoon. You got an 1892S, which is a better date, and you have won the gold. You will also receive jackpot entry number 35 for a chance to win more gold as Steph has just added a one gram gold to the end of stream sock up out the jackpot giveaway. So we have four jackpot prizes, two courtesy of Dennis, one courtesy of Steph, and we have the mystery one ounce silver round as well. So congratulations to Spoon. How about that? That's 530. And we're going to add that into your Wallet. All right, Spoon. That was intense. That was intense. All right. So, guys, we have reached the time where we will recap the buy it now options for tonight. So, if you're just joining us, we will recap the buy it nows that are still available. So let's see here. Okay, so the first buy it now here is uh, item number five. That is a pair of Valcambi Swiss one gram silver bars. The selling price, we rolled it back and the selling price was $9 after we rolled it, we rolled it back from 11. So if anyone wants it for nine, we have, I believe about 20 available. So this is for the pair, $9 for the pair. If anyone is interested all right, so we have TJ with a buy it now one, and please give it to Breeze. All right, TJ, very cool. We'll make a note of that. Give to Breeze. All right, we have Charles Kelly with a buy it now one. We have Patriot. Stacker with a buy it now one. And you will get uh, jackpot entries for the buy it nows as well. So TJ gets one. Uh, Charles Kelly gets one. Patriot Stacker gets one. We have Chris B 
for the buy it now one. That's nine dollars for the pair of one gram Valcambi Swiss. All right, let's uh let's get the jackpot entries. So TJ, your jackpot entry is number 95. Charles Kelly, your jackpot entry is number 78. Patriot Stacker, your jackpot entry is number 48. And Chris B, your jackpot entry is number 86. Here are the four, and they are in the jackpot. All right. The next buy it now is the 2016 Libra Tad. 2016 Libra Tad. And the price point for the 2016 Libra Tad was, we rolled that back from, I believe, $45. And we rolled it back all the way to $36. Buy it now. $36 for the one ounce 2016 Libra Tad. If anyone is interested, we have 10 available. We have Jay Corona with a buy it now one. Let's, let's pull one out here so you guys can see. All right, here we go. So that's the 2016 Libra Tats. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, so Jay Corona will pull that out for you. And that's a buy it now one at the $36 price point. If anyone else is interested, just put buy it now. We will write you down on the list. We have Chris B with a buy it now three. Chris B with a buy it now three. And we have Jules with a buy it now two. All right, let's get you your entries. Jay Corona, your ent uh, we have Clay with a buy it now one. And we have Steph with a buy it now one. And Rockzilla with a buy it now one. All right, Steph says give it to Reese. How cool is that? All right, Steph, we'll make a note here to give to Reese. All right, so let's get your entries here. So uh, Jay Corona, your entry is number 77. Chris B, you'll get three entries for your three buy it now. That's 40, 75, and 37. And uh, Jules, you'll get entries number 62 and number 64. Clay, you'll get entry number 43. Steph, you'll get entry number 94. And Rodzilla, you'll get entry number 68. All right. So there you have it. Uh, let's see here. And that's that's uh, the only buy it now remaining is the gold maple grams at eighty dollars. So the gold ma maple grams at eighty dollars is the only remaining buy it now. If anyone is interested, after that we will see how many entries we have remaining to give away before we unveil the winners. All right. It looks like we're all set, guys. So let's – we have seven jackpot entries remaining. Uh, excuse me, six. So we're going to break this into two entries each. Two entries each. We're going to pick three winners. Now, the three winners will each receive a one-gram Valcambi Swiss as well. 
So it's not just the jackpot prize. We are throwing in a little Halloween goodie, a one gram Valcambi Swiss. So here we go. Let's uh, put the link in here. If you guys have yet to comment, here's your chance. Hop over to that link. Leave a comment. If your name is selected, you will gain entry into a jackpot that has one ounce of silver, two ounces of copper, and one gram of gold. So let's refresh one more time. All right, here we go. Good luck. This is for two entries. And the winner is Dwayne. Dwayne Mansell. Dwayne, congratulations. Let's uh let's pick another winner and we will give you guys the entries at the end. Steph says, pick me, pick me, pickle me. <laughs> and the winner is Silver Fish. Silver Fish, congratulations. We're gonna refresh one more time. Okay, two more people got in. And Brad Bird. Congratulations, Brad. So those are the three last minute entries. Now, Dwayne, Silverfish, and Brad Bird, you'll each get a one gram Valcambi Swiss as well. However, if you do not have an active wallet account, you must contact me via email to claim your prize. That's Sakaplata. NY at gmail.com. Brad, you do have an active wallet and Silverfish as well. So you guys are good to go. But Dwayne, if you hear me, oh, Dwayne's right there. So Dwayne, you're good to go, brother. Just confirm your uh, your shipping address unless you want to create a wallet account, which will allow you to claim prizes without being present and uh, such and such. Now, if you do have uh, an item still here. I can check and make sure you it's very possible that you may have an item here that you f forgot about. So I'll look into that. Just send me an email with your uh, updated shipping info so I can have that on file. All right. So here are the entries. So Dwayne, you'll get entry number 55 and 87. That's 55 and 87 for Dwayne. Silverfish, you will get number 88 and number 57. What's going on, Rahilio? Good to see you, Rahilio. And Fleabag is in the building. What's going on, Fleabag? Thank you for joining us. And Brad Burge, you will get number 56 and number 61. 56 and 61. And you'll get the one gram Valcambi. All right. So here we go. We're going to uh, get ready for the jackpot. So let's back this up. Let's back this up. And we are going to move the jackpot barrel into the center. And we'll try to do this quickly because I do not want any lag interference. Guys, if there's lag and I already pulled the number, there's no way I'm going to rob whoever wins. But we try to avoid that. But it is out of my control. So here we go. We have three bags. We're going to save the gold for the last prize. So that's jackpot prize number four. And that's courtesy of CSM Steph. So first we're going to do the goodie bags here. Now, if your name is first to be selected, you'll have a choice between one, two, or three, and we will check to see which coin is in your bag. So uh, here we go. Give me a thumbs up if we are clear to proceed, and we're going to shake things up here. And do you keep an eye on chat for any lag? Okay. All right, here we go. All right, and the winner is number 54. 54. Number 54 is Dennis. Uh, let's see. Wait, wait. It's TJ. It is TJ. Congratulations. I do apologize, Dennis. I had the entry next to your name as well, but it was on the other side. 
Congratulations to TJ. That's number 54. <laughs> That's right. That is 54. So TJ, select bag number one, bag number two, or bag number three. What's it going to be, TJ? Three. All right, number three. Here we go. This is what you have in bag number three. Not only do you have a megaton of candy, you have the new auction sticker, and you have the one ounce copper panda, 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 panda. So congratulations, TJ. The one ounce panda, courtesy of Dennis Stewart. And you'll see what candies you got. <laughs> and yeah, there's a there's a lot of candy in there as well. So there you have it. <laughs> Hidden likes that. <laughs> All right. So TJ, congratulations. We're gonna tag it. All right, next up, here we go. Winner number two is number 14. Number 14 is Sharp Eye for Coins. Sharp Eye for Coins, congratulations. You have won an end of stream Halloween goodie bag. Are you here? Sharp Eye, are you here? Come on, Sharp Eye. You must be here to claim your prize. Hopefully, Sharp Eye is still hanging out. All right. We're going to have to... Uh... Oh, he's streaming? Is Sharp Eye streaming right now? Let's see here. Well, Sharp Eye definitely did participate. What I'll do is, uh, oh, you know what? He has, yeah, well, because he made these purchases, he has an active wallet account. He is streaming as well, and I definitely don't want to rob anybody. So uh, what we'll do is we'll let the next winner select, and whatever they don't select will be uh, Sharp Eye's prize. Oh, there he is, Sharp Eye. All right, Sharp, sharp Eye, thank you. So uh, congratulations as Mrs. Plant is laughing in my face right now. <laughs> <laughs> sharp Eye, would you like number one or number two? What's it going to be? Number one or number two? You just won an end of stream giveaway. I try to be as fair as possible, guys. So, you know, usually we have certain... Uh, rules in place, and I do have to go by them. He said but, always number two. But sharp eye, you get grab bag number two or goodie bag number two. And let's see what you have here. Boom! Sharp eye for coins. You have just won the 2018 one ounce the barber. Zombuck Silver Round. How cool is that? Wow. Now, these were going for over 60 or what is it? Over $50 they were going for on the auction. Sharp Eye got stabbed in the eye there by a scissor, <laughs> says <laughs> Steph. <laughs> Congratulations, Sharp Eye. That is awesome. You get the uh, the candy and the auction sticker as well, and we will tag it. Very cool, sharp eye, <laughs> sharp eye. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. And you like to move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. Oh, we're back. We are back. We are back. We are live from New York, New York. Big shout out goes to 
Sharp Eye for Coins, who is streaming this at the moment. Very cool, Sharp Eye. Big shout out to all your followers, uh, followers and subscribers. All right, here we go. The final grab bag will go to number 85. Number 85 is, let's take a look here, Rockzilla. Congratulations, Rockzilla. You will get a goodie bag and with some candy for the kiddos with a sticker. And you get the one ounce copper area 51, courtesy of Dennis Stewart. So there you have it. Congratulations to Rockzilla. And let's uh, tag this as well. But wait, guys. Oh, Rockzilla says, give it to Gigi. Boom. How cool is that, Rockzilla? Thank you for that. That is awesome. Gigi, you don't need any more candy. <laughs> but you can have the one-ounce copper round, courtesy of Dennis Stewart, courtesy of Rockzilla. That is very, very cool. Thank you for that, Rock. Definitely appreciate it. Gigi, come here. Where is she? Oh, she's jumping around. I think she just did a lap in the. <laughs> she just did a lap in the house. <laughs> Here you go, Gigi girl. That's courtesy of Rockzilla. Thank you, Rockzilla. <laughs> that was awesome. Thank you, Rock. This is my reward of jumping on the bed. No, no. <laughs> you know, you know what they say when monkeys jump on the bed. One fell off the and bumped his bumped head. His head. I bump, I bump my head about two times a day. Uh, <laughs> I sure did. That's what happens when you forget when cabinets are still open, when, you know, you just hit your head all the time. All right, guys. Next up is the gold, courtesy of CSM Steph. We have a one gram gold that will be given away right now. Thank you so much for doing this, Steph. And let's shake it up. And the winner is number 27. Number 27 is EMP. Boom! Congratulations, EMP. You have just won the one gram gold courtesy of CSM Steph. And the crowd goes wild. Incredible. EMP, you just won the gold. That is incredible. Wow. EMP. How cool is that? Congratulations, EMP. The gold is yours. Wow. Courtesy of Steph. Big shout out goes to Dennis Stewart and Steph for sponsoring uh, some jackpot prizes tonight for the end of stream giveaway. I really do appreciate that, guys. That is just incredible. And for those that are new, thank you guys so much for, for being here, for joining us. We have a great community of people, and uh, it really is something special what we have here. Shout out to Silver Sacks, Maximus Silver Stacker, U.S. Silver Stacker. We have Spoon in the building, Rockzilla, Clay 37, Rockin' Roots, everybody here that's been here even from the very beginning. I do appreciate the support. That is incredible. How about that? A big congratulations to all the auction winners. And a uh, shout out goes to those who participated tonight, not even just for the bidding process, but just to hang around in general. Once again, guys, you are not required to participate in the bidding process. Feel free to hang out with us. We always have a great time. And for those that are new, every Tuesday and Friday, I stream at 8 p.m. Eastern time. This Tuesday, 
we will be having the long anticipated ultimate grab bag batch number three. It is official. Spoon is the only donator on the lineup right now. It is $25 per grab bag. If you guys are interested, all you have to do is send a $25 donation to SakaBlatheNY at gmail.com. If you need more information about the Ultimate Grab Bag, you can find the Ultimate Grab Bag Batch 1 and Batch 2 on my channel as we uh, are looking forward to it, guys. And uh, I will see you all on, on Tuesday at 8 p.m. If anyone has any questions, you know where you can find me, NY at gmail.com. And uh, if I do not receive payment uh, for the duration of the stream, I will invoice you within 24 hours of tonight's auction. I hope you had a great time. Uh, Adam says, can you send me a... Absolutely, Adam. I will send you a picture of your wallet. Uh, most likely early tomorrow morning I can do that for you. And uh, uh, Mrs. Blanca, can you just pass a little sneak preview here? Yep. Uh, the gold. The gold. So, guys, I do trust you. I do trust you <laughs> holding a $1,000 coin in your hand. <laughs> now, guys, this coin was actually scheduled to be on tonight's auction. However, what... I did was I always verify the registration number on the PCGS website. The, the number was not coming up. Although this is authentic, it's been checked and uh, cleared. Because the number was not coming up in the system, I did not want to put it on tonight's auction. So what I did was I called PCGS, I informed them, and they're going to update the system to reflect the number here. What they said was in a rare case that it may have to get sent back in and get a new number, they will do that for free. However, I just did not want to have to go through the hassle of explaining that while auctioning it off. So what I'm hoping to do is auction it off on next Friday's auction. That's Friday at 8 p.m. Eastern time. So this is a $25 gold, and it will be on next Friday's auction unless, unless anyone would like to start a bid for this. But I didn't want to put it on the list because of the very reason that that number is has to be updated. So uh, let's see here. What I was going to do, uh, the starting bid here would probably be uh, 1020, and we can go from there. That's the 2017 MS70. 1020 would be the starting bid if anyone wants to take the shot. If not, it will be up for auction this upcoming Friday, regardless. And Dennis, is that a bid here? Well, he put ten dollars into <laughs> Dennis with the ten dollars and twenty cents. Dennis, please clarify that. <laughs> let's let's uh let's reiterate. We mean one thousand and twenty dollars. <laughs> Kelly, we can definitely start you a new wallet. Mia's here. Oh, you're very welcome, Mia. Hope you're enjoying yourself. It's great to see you here. Now, we are wrapping things up, but I did want to put this out there for those that are interested. This will be available next week, Friday at 8 p.m. Eastern time for the World Coin Auction. So I hope to see you this Tuesday for the ultimate grab bag. Hidden sends a $1,900 bid on that hidden. So I will take that uh, into consideration. $1,900. <laughs> uh, Hidden, you are funny, brother. <laughs> All right. So uh, regardless, guys, I want to thank you all for being here and joining me. We're going to wrap things up tonight. 
And uh, you guys enjoy yourself tomorrow. If you're going to trick or treat, be safe and be careful, but enjoy yourself. Most importantly, make some memories with the family. And uh, so it is goods and services. However, if you feel comfortable sending friends and family, that's okay as well. I just want to do right by PayPal and avoid any shutdowns since my Google Pay was closed uh, a couple of days ago. So I I'm trying to be extra careful. So uh, regardless, guys, thank you guys so much for joining me tonight. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I sure had a blast as always. You guys are always great to hang out with. And I look forward to seeing you all on Tuesday at 8 p.m. for the ultimate grab bag. Take care, everybody. Bye. Happy Halloween. Hmm.